До рассвета утром проснусь, солнцу на горе. Thy servant, as if a man to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy One. The fact that now with the economy, it will not be in a trial of a younger kind than money, not in a trial. The very soul of the slave is now written to him forever and ever. What about me, Mashenka? Well, without. It's always bitter when death takes people like Mikhail. Misha was my cousin Tanyusha. And it's like a brother to me, too. And you, Stepan, Vlad, have to do this. They should be like this. So your father will be calmer in heaven. Sleep well, dear brother. And I'll tell you how. Mikhail worked all his life so that both the house and the farm. I didn't feel sorry for myself, yes, but the owner was real. And his son, so that's how it was. And the cow sheet is new. Stepka, do you hear? To finish as the folder wanted. I'll do everything. Everything that the father left, everything will go to the farm. It's not up to you to decide. I didn't decide. The father decided. Not a penny will leave the house. And who does not agree, can leave himself. And don't drive me away, I'm at home. Stepushka, smooth, don't. Why should I drive you away? You'll escape by yourself. You don't care about the house or the household. Your household is burning with fire. Oh, wait a minute. My father has worked himself into it, but I won't and you will give me my share. What share? There is no your share here. Do we have up to a tree, or what? I'm someone. I'll kill you. I'll kill you. There are no peddlers. As Tanisha was gone, so there was no one. And what about a bachelor? But how much does one need? So, either a sister or a niece will look in, clean up, and so everyone is alone. So don't forget. And here, pull one, calm down. Well, what have you done, you bastard? He did not give his father a human escort. Well, you can't do that in public. I'm a bastard, too. Well, who? I'm Uncle Peter, all my life as a farmhand. 
I was also reproached that I didn't go to vocational school, but stayed at school. Dad has been saying all my life that I hide behind books from work. It's that stock over there who's ready to pick at the manure every day, but I've done enough, I've picked at it. What am I, like? Which one? And grab everything for yourself, isn't it? Well, why yourself? Well, that's right, your brother says. That's all for the farm. And here's the blow. I'm leaving anyway. Oh. Where are you going? Well, why didn't our village work out for you? And here they don't teach what I want to learn. What's that for? And how to earn a lot of money with your head? Can I have a bream? You can. Hi there. Listen, someone's birthday is coming up. Yes, I wonder who has it. Well, so one girl. And, by the way, something special is due for excellent studies. Can she ask for something? As an adult has every right. But within reason. Dad. Can I invite my classmates? Where to? Well, home, here. I don't know. Dad, please, please, please. Well, one time, I'll do it myself. I really want a real party. Can I? Of course you can. So, what are you reading? Interesting? Yes. It would be nice, of course, if it were mathematics, because we have what soon? Certification. Exactly. That's it. Come on. This is for you. Oh, thank you. Here you go. And what is it? Yes, what is it? Surprise. Nikita. Yes. Hi there. Hi guys. I'll catch up. Oh, this is for you. And what is it? Look. Wow. Guys. The same way. Wow. This is for you. Look. Well, Vladka, are you going to say goodbye? With the mother, it is necessary. No, I'm not going. Cadaver to sing. You're at the station, aren't you? And I have to go to the market. Mom was going to get sick. Hello, Mirka, what do you have here? Eggs. Eggs. Come on, sit down. Hi there. Hi there. Oh. Uncle Peter, stop. What did you have to? Miroslav, bye. Bye, Vlad. Oh, no. I'm going for a walk. There's not much left. I'll look at the mountains. When will I see them now? You're with your brother. Make up. Brothers should be like this, but you are like a cat with a dog. And it's bad with my mother that I didn't say goodbye. It's good for you. Do you have any money? There is. 
Well, it's necessary. This is for you. Until you've learned how to earn a lot of money. Thank you, Uncle Peter. Well, be healthy. Well, goodbye. What a house. Eh, uh, and she dresses like a mouse. I agree. Yes, a mouse from a golden mink. Who's there? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Lisa. Happy birthday to you. E? Sad people should drink adult drinks. Please don't. I'm sorry. Wow, and you're cool. Right extreme. Not me. This is my dad. He likes to travel. Do you like it too? Not really. What do you like? Here. Cool. <laughs> Just open the day. Oops. Come on, tell me. Well, where's the fun? All together, all to me.
Is anyone there? Who? So much for a month before retirement. And what about the hostess? Well, what do you think? I recently buried my husband and immediately my son. She's your date with the killer. Is the deceased relative yours? Yes, the nephew is a cousin. Wherever you look, there are relatives everywhere. Matchmaker, brother, you can't figure it out here. Guys, wait a minute. Have you seen these holes on the neck? I saw it. It burned down a lot. Let the expert sort it out. Come on, load it up. It's too early to draw conclusions, but it looks very much like arson. What kind of arson? Who is the arsonist? If you find it, we'll find out who. So, Stepan was killed, and the hut was set on fire. Did he swear with whom? Did he conflict? He's not with anyone. No, well, they really had a fight with their brother at the wake before the fight. But Vladka brother could not in any way. What do you mean, nothing? There are few cases. Where is this what's his name brother? Yes, I myself brought him to the station yesterday. He was going to town. However, I sat him down earlier. At the turn on the cane. Well, you see. And you say you couldn't. So they closed the year. Why is it so cold here? I'm going to warm up the car. Yes. Vladimir Pavlovich, you can persuade me for a long time. Yes. Until tonight. Come on. Yes. You understand me correctly. Another conversation. That's good. Yes, goodbye. Let's consider the basic properties of the natural logarithm, which are often used in calculations. Common F. Common F. What were we just talking about? Um. Derived function. Lazanka. We are talking about the basic properties of the natural logarithm. I really hope that attentiveness and diligence will return to you soon. Sit down. So, let's continue. Natural logarithms. With a base greater than 1, a larger number corresponds to a larger logarithm. Vlad is a relative. Of course I do. He came to us for tickets, 
but they were expensive. Only Saint I asked for the mom. What's up? How's the mom? He muttered something and that was it, and ran away. And what have you done? It's nothing. Thank you. Yes, I'll run there's a queue already. So Latrovich didn't leave. Well, it turns out that it is. Where will we look? I don't know. He has no one in town. Maybe he's hiding here. And with what the motorcycle disappeared. Just another motorcycle. Why didn't you say anything? Yes, they had an old Java. Mishkin still. Here you go. Ah, uh, let's see. Careful, there are steps here. Well, then, look, it acts strictly according to the instructions. Yeah. If something is wrong, call by phone. The phone is there on our table to pass. Well, here's your place of work. The kingdom, so to speak, is a state. So, let's look at something by. Vladislav Rudik was awarded the qualification of boiler room operator. Where did you get the measles? In the army. Oh, in the army. That's good. And where can I charge my phone? There's a socket right there, behind the microwave. Look, it means that here we can have a cup of tea. Yeah. That's where it's about to take a poke, but without alcohol. You understand, right? I understand. Look, don't drive girls. You understand, right? How exactly? Oh, well done. Well, so that cleanliness, order was like in the army. So, if something is wrong, contact me right away. Well, I don't promise that I will help, but I will recommend something. No, we have to go. Is it possible for three or four days? You can't. And who will work? Well, I'm going to rip off a replacement from a legitimate weekend, eh? Do you understand? No. I understand. I'll work it out. My brother died. Can I? Yes. Hey, Dad. Lisa, we need to talk. You know, I always thought that my daughter was a very grown-up, intelligent person, and I was sure that she was not capable of stupidity, especially in a year when you need to go to university and you waste time on low-grade waste paper. Do you understand what I'm talking about? I hope that you will draw the right conclusions. It's late, I have to go to bed. Good night. There were only expensive tickets there. If I had bought it, I would have been left without money. And wait for the next train at 3 in 4 hours. It's unclear what's going on with the seats. I went to the guides. But I made an agreement with one. The name of the conductor? I don't know. What kind of car? The third one. Maybe the fifth. I don't remember. Maybe the seventh? And maybe the seventh, yes, probably. Uh. Clearly. And where's the motorcycle? What kind of motorcycle? Java is yours.
So it was Stepan who only went and probably needs a toilet in the barn. I see. Here's what, Vladislav Mihailovich Rudik. I have to detain you. Before finding out, so to speak. For how long? That's how it goes. Maybe forever. Lisa, this. Hi there. There is a grandiose offer. Escape. Where to? To London, to Paris. Do you want to go to Zydemir? No, you don't want Zydemir. Well, all right, we won't run to Zydemir, we'll just run away from lessons. Didn't we want to take a picture? Yes, but we were going in the evening. It's nothing, it's better from him. We are free people. In a free country, nothing prevents us from skipping a couple of lessons. Nick, I don't know, I've never done that. Time makes a non-standard decision. Yes. Yes. Great discoveries are waiting for us. Lucky you, man. They found your guide quickly. Otherwise, I'd be sitting here. Did you like it? No. Clearly. Where are you going now? I don't know. Let's go to my place, and tomorrow we'll go to Stepan's funeral together. You and your brother never had time to make up. Well, at least you'll bury it like a human being. And where is the mother? The mother is bad. She refused to go to the hospital. She's at Lavrusha's with Galina now. Galina drinks her off there with her herbs. Come on, sit down, let's go. You, Marika, don't look that it is fragrant and bitter. That's how it should be. He'll let you go now. So she let go. That's better. Mom, it's me. Stipe, are you? Mom. It's me, Vlad. Stepushka, you can't be here. You can't be dead here. Go away. Mom, it's me, Vlad. Which Vlad? Your son. I had a son, Stipe, and he is no longer there. And I don't know you. You go away. Mom. I don't know you. Go away. Here you go. Better than any medicine. It will calm your nerves at once. You, Vladka, don't fuss in vain, and don't be mad at your mother. She's not herself yet. Not gone yet. She needs to be taken to the hospital. 
Which hospital? To a mental hospital. You drop it. And the doctors have already looked. They said she was healthy. She's in shock right now. It takes time and peace to move away. And you want her in a mental hospital. Have pity on her. Don't touch your mother. Give me peace. Maria is not a stranger to us. Let him stay with us for now. It's not a burden for us. Thank you. So that's it. There is work, there will be money. I'm going to translate for you for my mother. Well, there's everything. Well, buy something there. Here, take as much as you need. That's for sure. And that's right. She'll be fine. And I'll talk to her later. When everything clears up, and I'll talk for you. Thank you, Uncle Peter, for giving me a lift. Come on, you would have run through the mountains yourself with your feet. Yes. Well, I'm going. So you're not staying for the funeral? We need to work. Come on. Good luck to you. Well, look, if anything, come back. Tell the conductor to open the doors at the junction, and then we'll get out. Is it really possible? Well, we agreed with him. Listen, well, this is such a complex literature. It was necessary to read some verse. The horror. I agree. Another teacher. Oh, the fox. Hi there. Hi there. Hey, where have you been? Yes, in short, at the last lesson the teacher called your dad. She asked where you were. Linda, where have you been? Okay, come on, bye. Yes, bye, bye. See you later. Hello. Who's there? Who came there? Nobody. Probably made a mistake. Dinner is ready. Nikitushka. Dinner. I don't want to. Two on one. And now, Katya, let's not go have coffee. Agreed? Agreed. Hello, Vasily Alexeevich. Wait a minute, please. But just a minute. What do you want? Here's the thing. The train is slowed down at the sidings, and the locals ask the conductors to open the cars for them and put them in. And the nearest exit. Another trip, in general about what? Well, Vlad could have gotten off earlier. We need to question the conductor again. We need a guide. And Vlad is not necessary. 
The conductor confirmed that Vlad, Rudy got on the train and went to the city. That's it, we close the case. Have you found it, or what? Who? The murderer of whom? What kind of murderer, uncle? We close the case as an accident. Oh, wait a minute. And the holes are right here. Well, he couldn't have done it himself. What does the expert say? Katya, just one more minute. Where are you going? Who are you? Sherlock Holmes sucks. It's a hanging iron. You can't unwind it, and the indicators for the district could not be worse. You have a retirement and legal pension in a month. And you're offering me another job to hang on myself? Go home, uncle. Katyun, coffee. Can you do something stronger? A couple of cocktails. I'll ask. Hi there. Hello, can you tell me where the subway is? And this is there. 30 minutes, maybe more. Ah, uh, thank you. Listen, let's give you a ride. No, don't, I'll do it myself. Come on, come on. Yes, have a seat, don't be shy. Thanks, I'm the best. Parking is prohibited, and they will also find us on the way to help. Come on, come on, come on, let's go. Nothing's going to happen to you. Don't be afraid, we won't do anything. Well, let's go. We really will give you a ride, we will help. It's not difficult for us. Come on. All right. Come on, hurry up and get fine. Well, where are you? Zoya? Zoya, Lisa will appear, call me right away, okay? Well, it's a multiple. Are you farting? Lawyer, what are you doing? He scared the girl. And what, by the way, is the girl's name? And really, what is the girl's name? Guys, where's the subway? Underground. Well, really, I have to go home. You will be in the morning. Everyone needs to go home. Uh, where are you going? And Nuri, pass for her. Up, 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 look how well done Taya is. And, as a straight athlete, hookahs, hookahs, let's go higher, my little one. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Calm down, we'll all be at the finish line. Help me. Somebody, please help. To help. Batman is coming now. Yeah, in a blue helicopter. What are you, huh? You should get out of here, comedians. Batman. A new series of deaths of the heroes. Good evening. Who's there? Excuse me, I'm Nikolai Kamenev, the father of Lisa and Nikita's classmate. If he's at home, I'd like to talk to him. Nikita, who is Lisa? Her dad came here, wants to talk to you. Good evening, good evening. Do you know where Lisa is? Look, will it fit? Yes, of course. There's an outlet behind the microwave. Everything that was in the stall. You're probably hungry, you could have gone to the supermarket to buy something. No, that's not necessary. Baskets. My favorites. Will you? 
No. Why? I don't like sweets. And what do you like? Read. Textbooks. I'm getting ready economically. I see. My dad wants me to go there too. That's great. Not really. I mean, dad wants to, but you don't want to? Yeah, sort of. So where do you want to go? I don't know. I want something related to art. But you can't earn money in art. You sound just like my dad right now. And how did you end up here alone at night? Well, did you run away from these freaks? Well, that's understandable. I mean in general. Is there some kind of napkin to wipe your hands? Yes, of course. There is toilet paper. Come on, it'll do. Well, actually, I ran away from home. Wow. Me too. Seriously? Cool. Nothing cool. Your phone's on. Call your friends, tell them where you are, that everything is fine. They're waiting, worried. And yours? Do your people know where you are? Maybe they are also waiting and worried. Mine hardly. What's the address here? Are you awake? No. Meister Pashka from where? The fire was dismantled. My son. And what do you do on vacation? What kind of vacation? Then you have a vacation here, but we first need to drive the cattle from the pasture to the mountains and mow hay. Then strata, then potatoes. Don't touch it, please. You know, you city people are so funny. Come to us, tourists. Walk back and forth with your mouths open. Ski shields. What a joy in general. You probably just haven't tried it. I tried it. I didn't like it. Well, then, I didn't understand. So what is there to understand? You don't know how to spend money, so you roll it. And you, then, can... Well, there would be money. Earn it. I'll earn it. All right. And what is the most beautiful thing you have? Maybe a mountain or a river? Or are there interesting traditions? The most beautiful. And they say that our crystal peaks are the most beautiful. Crystal peaks. Good evening. Буду 
счастлив я или нет. Ой, ты солнце ясное, дай мне ответ, буду ли счастлив я. It was necessary to go to Irina Sergeevna. I've already put in a good word for you. In the agricultural? What's the difference? Mom, the main thing is to enroll and start studying. For what? For the sake of the military department. If you are already studying, then in London, at the design school. You should have come to your senses, grandson. How much money does it take? And your mother, in order to buy you off from the army, got into debt. Mom, well, let him eat in peace. Listen, here's what I think. Or maybe sell it to the country. Or change the apartment to a smaller one with an additional payment. I don't need your sacrifices. Thank you. Very tasty. Nikita. Nikitushka. Mom, is that why you're pulling it all the time? And how much do you think we can sell the cottage for? One and a half billion. Don't give me any more. You wait until the position is not afraid, then take it in parts. But be careful. We don't need any extra noise on the basin. Understand me? That's it. Let's take action. Sorry. Work. Nothing. Well, yes. Elizaveta Nikolaevna is perfectly healthy. Now about you. So, Sviatoslav Igorevich, I have literally five minutes. Yes, yes. Well, what is it? Well, what did you show me? Has anything bothered you lately? Only the exchange rate. I don't like the results of biochemical blood tests. So, I feel great. Composition. But I really have to go. Maybe you can come to me tomorrow morning? I want to check something. I'll try. Have a nice day. Thank you very much for an interesting lecture. You know, it's great when successful, accomplished graduates of our university share their experience and knowledge with you, current students. You have a test, Dad. Business is a combination of war and sports. Neither there nor there has grown by chance, and by the way, this year, as usual, we will conduct a competitive selection of interns for students of the second and more senior courses in our company. This is a very good chance to look at how the business works in real conditions. Ivanova, well done. With my back. Come on, work. Damn it. Petrenko, get it together, get it together. How much is possible? Volashina, well done. Five points. Nikolai Borisovic, I'm sorry. Thank you very much for the lecture. They don't teach us that here. Please. Have we met before, Yevgeny?
Petrenko. What are we going to do? Yes, it's because of the injury and has not recovered yet. Injuries have nothing to do with it. Everyone has their own reserve. In short, the Federation has decided that Volashina will go to the world instead of you. How old are you? How long were you going to run from this? Well, like me, I've been in sports all my life. And now are you? Are you throwing me in the trash or something? Oh, what kind of light do I see on the balcony? Juliet, you're like day. And then I forgot. Straighten the balls. Yeah. I'm going to need your help again. Which one? Turn around. I want to put together a portfolio and send my work to the London School of Design. What if I get a scholarship? So, come on, you're flying away. Mary Poppins, goodbye. Take a sip. All right. Turn your back, spread like wings. Next Monday morning. Nikita, I can't do it on Monday. Well, or let's do it after lunch. Matan will be there, and I'm going to sit down soon, and I don't understand a damn thing anyway. Why study where you don't like? To do what you don't want to do. Nick, you know that. I know. Dad, will you always obey him in everything? Okay, that's it, I'm off. Okay, I get it. I'm sorry. I just wanted to take some photos in daylight. And then at the studio. And Monday is the only day off in the registry offices. I spend all day photographing a wedding to earn my tuition. All right. After all, I can take a synopsis from someone. And you'll pass everything? Yes. Look. I looked at the new tests. The fact is that the indicators of cancer markers are greatly overestimated. Is that for sure? Not yet. But it is necessary to do a number of more in-depth studies. Very well. Scheduled in the near future, tell me when I arrive. All right. Hello, sushi delivery. I'm downstairs. All right. Okay, I'm waiting. Thank you. Girl, is that you with Korean cosmetics? Karinka. Petrenko. Ritka. It's crazy. How are you? I can't believe it. And do you remember how Fedka Semchev ran away at the summer training camp during the dead hour in the cinema? Forget how we tore up the base territory, it was going to cripple the guys. And now, the champion of the country, the Olympic hope. Oh, how I envied those who got into the national team, what to envy. I got here and what's the use? Come on, Karina, everything will get better. When I finished physical education, they took me only to a children's sports school. Salaries are pennies. You won't live. Nothing, thank God, I got a job here. I have been bringing sports to the masses for three years. Boring, well, but stable. And you can earn extra money on individuals. Listen up. Is it difficult to get a job here?
Hello, Uncle Lavrish. Hello. How are you there? Great. Adjustment. Nothing. Alive and well. How did the money arrive? How is mom feeling? And where should they go? They came. Mother, nothing. It became calmer. Especially when no one reminds you of the past. Hey, judge, to sharpen hair Eliasai. We don't get paid for it. That's it, Drusha, I ran. Thank you very much. Are you ready? All right. Oh, why didn't you finish it? You don't listen to me, sister, and then you get upset. Finish it. Sorry, check mark. No. <sighs> the service is coming soon. I'll go outside and get some air. Drink, let's go. You and Lavre. My saviors have sheltered and fed. Treat. God will reward you for this. Come on. Come on. Oh, something, something's gone dark again, oh, 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 the head. Come on, here, it's because you're not listening to me, sister. You don't want to be treated. You know, Marika, you lie down and rest, and I'll light a candle for you. I'll say a prayer. Thank you. Sit down, sit down. Sorry for the wait. Hello. I congratulate you on the successful completion of the competitive selection. Well done. As they say, welcome to Top Invest. And at the same time, let me introduce my partner Roman Evgenievich mate. Thank you, Kolya. Hello. I join in the congratulations. An internship within the walls of our company will allow you to understand from the inside all those subtle processes that occur in such a complex organism as an investment bank. You will have to work in different departments for this, for a month in each. The internship will last five months. We really hope for your serious relationship and selfless work. In short, all your excuses about sessions, tests, sleepless nights before exams are not accepted. Your main job starts on Monday. Yes, the weekend is ahead. Maybe one of you will change your mind. All right, good luck. Go ahead and sing. Rudik Vladislav Mihailovich, a first-year student. Don't we take interns starting from the second year? I didn't tell you, the guy helped Lisa a year ago, you could say. The head of the course, a candidate for an increased scholarship based on the results ahead of schedule from this session. I gave him the opportunity to pass the competition on a par with everyone and that's it. Listen, can we go for a walk somewhere tonight, Friday? that you look like shit. How are you feeling? Thank you, everything is fine. Sorry, old man, it won't work today. I have to go somewhere else. Well done for coming in. Only LaRue went to the mountains. Now it will be in three days. Have a seat. How is Maria? 
gets tired quickly. He'll hang out with me in the kitchen, and then lie there all day. I've been having nightmares all night, poor thing. Only now I've fallen asleep. So, maybe you need to go to the doctor in the city? And then the current doctors understand a lot. Let me give you, neighbor, my signature pour. Oh, it's possible. I'm not on duty anymore. Here. Well, for you, the owners. Ons door of echo. Listen. How do you manage with our pensions, eh? They would have taught me. I'm watching it, the battery is new. The TV. Another time I don't know how to make it to the end of the month. Well, fortunately, my sister will throw potatoes, then salsa. And you, you'll give birth, and you don't really have a household? So sheepskin, lava leads to the city. Here's a penny dripping little by little. Hello, Maria. Hello, Pyotr Andreevich. I'm sorry if I woke you up. I came by to check on you. Thank you. And what about Vladka? Well, there, called, came. Oh. Go, Peter, go. You see, she's sick. Well, quiet, quiet, quiet. It's okay, it's okay. Let's go, let's go, let's go to bed now and again slowly. What are my chances of getting out? Medicine is moving forward by leaps and bounds every day. And from the treatment protocol, after which a person goes into remission for many years. I can recommend a clinic in Germany. When I found out that my wife was Iraqi, I took everything. The best clinics and the most expensive medicines. And it's been nine years since she's been gone. Thank you. Yes, hello. Hello to you. Should I expect you for dinner? Zoe's got so much cooking going on here. I'll be home in 20 minutes. And while you and Uncle Roma were fishing, I wandered around. And you made me sing so that I wouldn't get lost. Yes. And when I woke up in the tent in the morning, everything was covered in snails. It turns out that you collected them all over the island, and then put them in your backpack. Dad. What are you? What happened? It's all right. Just got up. Are you sure? Yes, of course. All right. Then I'll go. Wait. Lizuan. Let's go somewhere tomorrow, shake up the old days. Dad, the session is coming up. Well, yes, yes, you're right, of course. As you recommend yourself now, you will swim to the diploma. And by the way, in Latronic, your savior, got into our group of interns. Ruich? Yes. So he's a freshman. There is an exception. And let me take you to the university on Monday, and before that we'll go somewhere for breakfast. Dad, are you sure you're not sick? No, I can't on Monday. There will be big traffic jams, and I'll get there faster on the subway. But thanks. Finish your meal. Good night. Good night. Why? Love? Ah.
I would so like you and me to go to London. So that we can create there, come up with something. To be always together. Hi there. Hi there. And what happened? Nothing. What? Well, you didn't have it on the first two pairs. And? There was good weather on the sketches. I didn't want to miss it. Clearly. But it is unlikely that the sketches will give you admission to the mat analysis exam. Vladik, can we rewrite our synopsis? Of course. Thank you. See you later. Good afternoon. Karina, personal trainer, master of sports in biathlon. You know, if you add a system to your perseverance, you can achieve a very good result. I have only one result ahead of me. Finish. Well, yes. Everyone sooner or later finds themselves at this line. But if you think about the finish line all the time, then the whole distance flies by. You can't argue. And what kind of cuisine does the master of sports prefer? With a sea view. Is it possible to train outside the club? You can. Only I choose the place and time. All right. Can you shoot? On desire. Aren't you afraid of losing? Thank you. Three out of five is not a similar result. Very good. The desire to make a wish? Make a wish. Come on.
you're just lucky. Well, yes. Do you know how to drive a car? No, I'm skiing more. Do you want to try it? Kostya, hi. Good morning, Nikolai Borisovich. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. I have prepared the meeting schedule. Thank you, Katya. You look good. Thank you, Nikolai Borisovich. I warned you that you need to advance. It's okay to stay. What happened? Good morning. There's no other way to get through to you. I wanted you to see my project. Come on. When did you have time? Over the weekend? I finalized it over the weekend, and I started after your lecture at the university. Think about it even earlier. Probably still in the boiler room. Well, let's go. So, well. Yes, the thoughts are interesting, but, but raw. Let's do this. Come to me tomorrow at 10 and that's it. You see, Nikolai Borisovic, tomorrow is a free day and I took tickets to go home to my mother. But if, well, when you come, then I'll come. Thank you, of course. How's Lisa? Does she have time? Does she succeed? Lisa is a diligent girl. But I'm afraid she won't pass math. But if you want, I can study with her on the weekend. I passed the session ahead of schedule. There is time. I am not ready to accept unselfish help. But I can offer a side job. Hi there. Good morning. Lisa. Oh, wait a second, please. Yes, you can. Hi there. Hi there. How are you? I thought you had practice today. It's fine. And how are you at uni? Is there a problem? No, it's fine. I'm getting ready for the session. It will be more convenient this way. Dad, I'll pass everything. Are there any problems after all? Well, it's all complicated. I don't understand everything, and then I dig into the next material. It's like a snowball. I graduated from the university with honors and give lectures there. And you're setting me up. Give it back, please. I wanted to go out of town with you this weekend, but now you're going to stay at home and study. I've found you a tutor and I'll personally check everything you go through with him. Do you understand me? Oh, Misha, Misha. Well, it's been a year since Michaelo gave a blowjob. Come on, mammies. Hey, mom. Barely made it from the station. The bus broke down. The minibus does not go. Go away. My grandfather Dasha. Go away. Mom, what are you doing? A little. I brought it here. What are you doing? I didn't warn you. Nothing. And on a day like this. Don't let her see you. Go to Peter. Let's go. Let's go. Move. Now let's go home and have a drink and sleep. Has anyone heard anything? Maybe there were some incidents? They say that a year ago, Mara killed a young guy in the neighboring district. It got cold in the mountains, so he came down from the mountains and prowls through the villages. I see. Good afternoon, Major Splashchuk. What is known? Good afternoon, Senior Lieutenant Vassin. The identity of the victim has not yet been established. At around 7 in the morning, she became a victim of murder, rape. There are traces of beatings, multiple hematomas. 
But one very strange detail attracts special attention. This is a double puncture on the neck. It looks like a bite. A bite? Who's there? This is Vlad. Ruddick. Come on in. Ruddick, what a surprise. Hi there. The duties of the head of the course include checking the living conditions of fellow students. Nikolai Borisovic asked me to study with you. I thought he warned me. Warned? I didn't say it would be you, though. Come on in. White dance. Ladies invite gentlemen. I don't dance. You owe me a wish. But I can't dance, really. It wasn't your finest hour. Put your hand down. This way. And this? So insert it here. I see. And just listen to the music. Actually, it's all dancing. Doesn't that bother you? Look at your partner. And you're very good at it. Really? We will say that there is a variable x if the area of its change is known. And we can tell about each of any two of its values, which is the previous one, which is the subsequent one. Are you even listening to me? I'm listening, but I can't hear. No offense, please, but this is all terribly boring. Yes, mathematics is boring only for fools, well, or to those who do not understand it well. Let me try to explain it in another way. You're a lucky guy. You learn what you're going to do. All these formulas, puzzles, you just get high from them. Nick, finally. I found the same old age torments me here. Hi there. And, apparently, so far. Vlad, thank you very much. I think that's it for today, but I promise to repeat everything we went through. Have a good evening, bye. Can I walk you out? Yes, it's not worth it. I'll find a way out.
I'm all right now. I'll be at your place in literally 10 minutes. You took her, you took her. Nikita, come on. Let's go talk. I'll call you back. Well, how so? Why is it so urgent? So it happened. A place in the workshop has been vacated. Mom's loan was approved. Cool. It's cool that they support you. I believe you will succeed. Don't go limp. And that's it. I will write every day. Well, in general, there is progress, right? Still what? Lisa's doing great. I can't promise a 5, but she has a solid 4. All right. I'm sorry. Well, I passed everything. How much? How much? Great. Soar, everything is fine. Thank you. I couldn't have done it without you. Congratulations. Thank you. That's it. Let's go. And now what? Now to London. So you're going to leave and leave your father? Vlad, he won't even notice. I'm only on vacation. Moreover, it seems to me that he has someone. He leaves alone every weekend, and now he's going to Germany to dig on skis. Liz, listen, Nikolai Borisovic really needs you right now. He is going to Germany to take a chemistry course. What? Chemotherapy. Yes, Dad. Dad. Daddy. Why didn't you say anything? Wait, listen, everything's going to be fine. And I don't even hope, I won't leave you alone until you graduate from uni. And you will not become a stupid head to visit. By the way, did you pass the exam? Well done, well done. Everything will be fine. Well done. Let's go. Three, four. Ninety degrees hold. Six. Eight. We don't bring our knees together. All right. Thirty seconds break and the next approach I'm coming up now.
Hi there. Hi there. Come on in. Vlad, I'm sorry, I'm not in any mood to study today. Happy birthday. And these are your favorites, right? Baskets. I just thought you might be lonely. Thank you. Come on in. Well, for you. Happy New Year. With whom you will meet the New Year, you will spend it with him. Can I see it? Yes, you can. Cool. I used to draw this in school. When I was little, stupid, I believed in fairy tales. You're very beautiful. Since Nikolai Borisovich Kamenev had no other children, all the property of Nikolai Borisovich Kamenev goes to Elizabeth Nikolaevna Rudik and her future children. Karina Sergeevna Kamenieva is assigned a pension of 3,000 euros per month. Rudik Vladislav Mihailovich remains a collector's car Mercedes-Benz Trista LL Gawain Hello. Hello. Hi there. Why aren't you sleeping? I just left early so as not to stand in traffic. And, and in the evening, so as not to stand in traffic jams. Will you come back later? 
We live with you as in parallel worlds. Well, it's not my fault that your bohemian life starts after lunch. Lad, listen to me. Me. That's it. I can't talk. Let's see you tonight. Is it interesting here at you? Uncle Rom. Thank you for taking the time to come. I feel very lonely after Dad's death. Lazanka, I've known you since you were a baby. And after Nikolai died, it is my sacred duty to help you. What happened? My husband, Vlad, he disappears at work all day. And sometimes I get the feeling that he is married not to me, but to the office. And maybe we can come up with something so that he can spend more time with me. I'm really lonely right now. We'll figure something out. Well, do you have coffee here? Anything else? Thank you, Katenka. It's good that I stopped by. I just want to talk to you about your future. The fact is that Nikolai Borisovic saw you as the head of the trading department. And you've really proven yourself quite well. I agree that you are ready to take the position of head of the department. But, in my opinion, it should be the analytics department. Wait. You just said yourself that Nikolai Borisovic. Yes, yes, but, unfortunately, we did not have time to discuss his private opinion at the board of directors. Well, in that case, would prefer to remain in my previous position in the rating department. It's impossible. Competition within the department will negatively affect efficiency. Some of our big clients don't like your risky style very much. But that's exactly what Nikolai Borisovic valued in me. Maybe. Perhaps, but after the departure of Nikolai Borisovic, the company found itself in a dangerous position. And may I ask, maybe there are some other options? There are always options. Maybe after the grief that has befallen your family, it's better for you to take a vacation, go somewhere for a couple of months, to be with my wife, take a break. And then you will transfer me to couriers? You asked for an option. Lisa, I wanted to talk. Really? What do I hear? No, I'm talking about work. There's such a thing. Oh. Vlad, I don't want to. For once, we're having dinner together. It's about work again. We're having a romantic dinner. The working day is over. That's it. Maybe I should make an appointment with you. Sign up. But there were only three hours left in the bedroom. Lisa, I'm serious. It's very important, really. Can you give me a power of attorney for your vote on the board of directors? Why? Yes. One question needs to be solved. Well, I mean, it's the right decision. Vlad, you know, Dad has imposed restrictions, and I can't give my vote to anyone, even you. I'm sorry. What kind of question is that? Yes. Yes, 
I don't want Roman Evgenievich to become the new chairman of the board of directors, will you vote? I didn't understand. And what do you like about Uncle Roma? Wait, he's Dad's best friend. I trust him. And Dad, too. Why should I vote against him? But because, Lisa, your Uncle Roma does everything contrary to your father's wishes. He took your husband by the scruff of the neck and shoved him into analytics. I'm a gambler, you know. This is my job. I understand. But you also have a wife. You have a home. Yes, 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 wife, wife, yes, and the wife's house. I don't know, I am. Maybe I somehow got into your business without thinking, but I was the one who complained to Uncle Roma that I hardly see you. And I really wish you had more time for me, for example. So that's what it's all about. So you disappear all day in this gallery of yours, which doesn't bring a damn thing of money, but only devours. By the way, I spend my money on the gallery, and my investments will still be returned. You can be calm. And I'm calm. Well done. You know, honestly, I could have expected anything, but this, this is a punch in the gut. I've always been told that you didn't marry me, but your career. Here, please, I got it. <laughs> In general, they have already become arrogant. Hey, relatives. Mothers, open up. Got drunk again. Can you imagine, I had to borrow for the final cocktail. Because my boarding house, so to speak, is a tut-tut. How can you even live on that kind of money? But they live. Uh, slow down, mother-in-law, leave it. You've had enough, go to sleep. Oh. Why are you being bossy? By the way, you are not our commander. And the whiskey, by the way, is not yours either. And not mine. To our generous dad. In the fall, our baby would have been seven years old. If she had. Damn snow, but damn sports. Do you know what we wanted to call it? Matthew. So you're only 30. Heal up, stop drinking, you'll give birth to yourself again. From whom? There are no more of them. 
And if our baby was born, we would become a family. Family? Family? Not. You and I are both like pets to them. And Bokaliza needed me. She studied at the institute. Yes. I wrote term papers for her, coddled her. And after college I spent days plowing on her dad. At his own firm. And he also naively believed that he had become part of this family. And today our princess took offense at her doggy. Not affectionate enough with her. And tomorrow she will decide to have a kitten. And he'll throw his dog out the door. Family. I've never had a family. And probably never will be. So, son-in-law. It turns out that you and I are very similar. Maybe it's easier to just stop whining, huh? Taxi to the city is cheap. Taxi to the city is cheap. No, thank you, no need. Excuse me, but where does the minibus stop to the city? At the exit, taxi to the city, taxi. Downgraded or something? spouse are absolutely healthy. The reason why you are not getting pregnant is unknown. Most likely, it is not of a medical nature. It can be conflicts, stresses. Go on vacation, spend time together, avoid quarrels. As a last resort, we can try IVF. Naked. I'm sorry, please. I really wanted the best. And I promise I'll talk to my uncle. With Roman Evgenievich. After the holidays. I miss my dad so much. I really need you. No, I'm sorry. I'm a complete fool. No. You're skinny. My skinny smartass. Forgot to have lunch again today, right? How much? For the usual burners from a gas stove? Yes, not for the burners, for the art objects of the legendary Leonid Boitsikov. I told you, it's from the art trader's stock. That's it. 
trading in the past. So that's it. I take a microwave oven, blow it up, and we exhibit it in your gallery and call it art analytics. Maybe it will be possible to earn money somehow. Well, wow, did you say you don't like sweets? How you still fit after dinner? And since childhood I have learned to eat enough for the future. Tell me about your childhood. Well, I've explained to you a thousand times that there was nothing interesting in my childhood. Let's talk about your artist trader. Conceptualists. And how do you feel about this? Is this some kind of new mystery? Eco what? Economy? Ecology? In vitro fertilization. And what? It is impossible in the usual way. Hi there. Are you awake? Hi there. My son. So, tell me, what are your plans? To live. Son, I'm sorry. I don't want to put pressure on you. Well, you know, we have almost nothing left. Mom, I'll get a job. And we will extinguish everything. If only you hadn't stopped studying then. After all, so much money was gone. So much money. And where is your camera, Nikita? Sold it. I cannot but mention the success of our traders. who, despite the information provided by the analytics department, have achieved impressive results. Vlad Mihailovich, I think you should pay more attention to the department's performance of its tasks. Therefore, I am forced to revise the annual bonus to the department in a smaller way and significantly. Happy New Year! Roman Evgenievich, can we talk? Come on after the holidays. I'll be quick. As you know, I've only been heading the analytical department for a couple of weeks. And to decide all of us an annual bonus is unfair. The entire team is collectively responsible. And even more so her supervisor. You're part of this team now, right? I really don't have time. We'll talk next year. Hello to Lisa. Look, you're the head coach now. Give me literally a week and I'll be a Fightunyashka again. I can lead a group, I can go to an individual, if necessary. Karina, times are hard now, many have been fired. I have all the vacancies filled. Yes, and there are a whole sheet of additional replacements. Maybe it's closer to spring when they will run away on vacation. Well, yes, yes. Karen, I have to go. I'll run. You come in. Bye.
Yes, unfortunately, we will not be able to release catalogs before the holidays, but we will try to update the page on the internet before the new year. And by the way, I hope you will accept my invitation and come to celebrate the new year with us. I'm sure you won't regret it. With pleasure. Thank you for the invitation. Thank you. Yes. So we have a deal. All right. And spin around. Spin around. Spin around. Yes. Where's your camera? It's so unusual to see you without a camera. And I sold the old one. I haven't chosen a new one yet. Mold wine. Oh, please. Do you remember how you smuggled wine to my birthday party? Of course I remember. Do you know how worried I was? I've been planning for a long time. What? Get me drunk. Kiss you. A card. Thank you. So, this is for you. Thank you. Me. I. Selfies. Lind Bay. Vlad, I'm home. Vlad, where are you? Ah, uh, there you are. Hi there. I called you. Yes, I was at the meeting. We are preparing for the holiday. Am I interrupting? Here. Please lend your mother-in-law a taxi. Thank you, family. Don't wait early. She'll finish playing with me soon. I'll just kick you out of here. I'll throw you out. And what? Nothing. How are things at work? Great. Uncle Roma sends his regards. And as a New Year's gift, he deprived me and all the employees of the department of a New Year's bonus. I'll talk to Uncle Roma, as promised, after the holiday. I plowed into this firm. In return, what did you get? Demotion. Loss of earned bonuses. Now I'm being driven out of work. And what's next? I'm going to behave badly. And you're going to throw me out too. Or will you trade it for your photographer? Good afternoon. Kind. Let's get right to the point. With the help of the information that I am giving you, you will be able to drag large clients to a new trading company. I will enter this company offshore so that no one gets to the bottom of my interest in this case. I will transfer some of the information today, and the rest after you transfer the requested amount. But it sounds convincing. Okay, where's the information? Here are the details where you need to transfer the money. Wow. I didn't know you were interested. This is Grisha. Is it all your friends? Where is he? Yes. And he's at the ball until spring. You have an interesting acquaintance. Yeah.
for you. It's us. When was that? Prashka. <laughs> Funny. Please forgive me. I'm not feeling well. Maybe from these candles or incense. Let me fix it now. I just wanted to make it romantic. You sit down, I'll open the windows. No, I am. Nikita, I'm going. I really don't feel well. Let me walk you out. No, no, I have a car at the entrance. Итак, Новый год. 1 января. Надеюсь, все уже проснулись и с удовольствием доедаете оливье и шубу. Ну, а мы, мы поспешим с нашим новогодним гороскопом. Итак, что же ожидает нас в новом, только что наступившем году? It's time for romantic parties. But what are you? I'll be late. Whoever has been a good girl all year gets a gift. Hi there. Hi there. Thank you very much. Such a beauty. It's like us. I'm sorry, I didn't prepare anything. You are my gift. So, spit it out. What happened? It's probably kind of weird that I'm complaining about you. It's just, you know, Vlad and I have become like strangers. Although, Probably, we have never been particularly close, but... Why did you leave then? I always knew that your father wouldn't let us be together if I didn't achieve something myself. And then I found out that you got married. It seems to me that they are all still lost. 
everything can still be fixed. I'm back. To you. If only it were that simple. I'm sorry. This year is five years since our wedding. And maybe we can spend some time together. Away from everyone. So, Lisa, I'm not going to the mountains. I watched it all sickeningly as a child. You were born and not far from there. Exactly. And I'm not going back there. I've asked you a thousand times, let's leave this topic. I don't understand. There. Your family is there. And my family, too. Vlad. I have no one left but you. And I have. My father and brother died, but we don't communicate with my mother. Why? Vlad, I know what you're mad about. I should have been the first to tell about Nikita's arrival. But he's just a friend to me. These are memories from childhood. There can be nothing between us. But I understand that I provoked your reaction myself. This hotel complex is located 20 kilometers from your village. If you don't want to, we won't go there. We won't be seeing anyone. Just spend time together. I'm asking you for 10 days. If you're not ready to spend even a few days with me together. If you don't want to do anything to preserve our relationship, then yes. We are no longer connected. And we have to file for divorce. And where are you going? To the mountains. Did you pull me back to my native land? I guessed right. And the mountains are a chance. What chance? Well, at least to keep the family together or to return a happy widower. You never know what can happen in the mountains in winter. Have a good rest. Thank you. Grandfather, here you are. Wow. And who brought it? Courier. We didn't want to let him in at first, but the young man has all the documents to order and the data is yours. From whom? From the snow maiden, Grandma. <laughs> On Christmas holidays, locals come from all the districts with their goods. And in the evening it is put on in what it is a lot of. They drink, walk with torches, beach by the campfire. Why don't we dress up too? The girl is a beauty. Oops. Look at that dress. Handmade embroidery, Russia. 
Today is such a day that Woody. Which one? Under the city. Admitted it? Hello, Bogdan. Hello. Well, how's the mother? Check it out. Or are you afraid to drive? Flag. Look what wings I bought. Yours? The wife. The wife. Hello. I'm Bogdan. Here, a relative. And I'm Lisa. A sheepskin coat is necessary, yes? Come on. Well, wait. Here. I chose the lambs myself. Pamper your wife. Lisa, let's go. Yes, what? I'll give you a discount. I'll tell Aunt Maria what kind of wife you have. Here's a soft one. Yes, very beautiful. Enough? That's enough. Come on, please. Thank you. Sweet. Oh. Here, Mom, Uncle Patty's dimensional sister, and Tedra, Uncle Patty's late wife, Uncle Misha's cousin, and Vlad's late father. Here, how complicated he is. So, is Bogdan your cousin? Is it brisk? Well, the redhead is the one who sells hides. Well, Lishik, right? Probably. And why Lishik? Well, he also lives there in the forest for a whole year. No, he is the son of Lavrusha and Galina. And Aunt Maria just. And Maria is Vlad's mom, right? Yes, yes. Here. Well, Vladka, I think he will explain everything to you here himself. It turns out that we are all related to each other. That's it now, my little sister. The world, in my opinion, it's already clean. Yes. I should probably go. I'm going to go. I still have to go to the fair. In general, I have to go. So, I don't know. Oh, my god. Well. Very strong hands. Well, how am I now? Take it. Take mine. Oh, I'm uncomfortable. Where to? No, take it away. You said it yourself. We're like sisters now. Thank you. Are we going to take tea for sure? Gingerbread cookies. Yes, gingerbread. Very fresh. And I wanted a candle, too. So, and another cherry. Sweet wrap, so as not to break. Yes. Take another plum, you won't regret it. No, thank you. The cherry is enough. Are you sure? Exactly. You look gloomy and greedy, with a dark heart, Mara recognizes in a moment. And who is Mara? Mara is a spirit, a vampire. In winter, he descends from the peaks, lives in shepherd's huts, and tonight he will be looking for victims. It's awful. Yes, therefore, people disguise themselves as all sorts of spirits, devils, witches to confuse Mara. Come on, friend, hold it, please. Beauty, let's go for a friend, let's dance. No, no, thank you. No, not like that. All right. I'm tired already. Well, finally. Well, shall we go home? Yeah, probably. Well, we are unlikely to pass here. Let's go around the village. That's enough, that's enough. Lisa. Lisa. You guys are good. Lisa. 
lisa. Flag. Flag. Lisa. 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 Vlad. Vlad. Vlad, I'm here. Vlad. Calm down. Hush, 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 hush. Who is this? I was so scared. Yes, you never know who got drunk. And now they're buzzing. That's it, that's it. Quiet. Calm down. So, well... Let's get out of here somehow. Lisa. Damn snow, huh? Lisa. Lisa something. Where are you? I'm here. Here's a flashlight, see? I wouldn't find you. Where did you run off to, huh? Who is this guy anyway? Why is he running after us? No one is running after us. Just someone got drunk and everything. Oh, fuck. The phone's dead, huh? Give me your phone. I probably left it in the cabin. Well, of course. Why take your phone with you? Ah, uh, let's go. Where to? Do you know where to go? There. Where to go there? Wait, 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 wait. I don't understand anything. It's like we're walking in circles. Are we lost? No, they didn't get lost. But you still have to wait for morning. Morning. Well, you wanted romance. We will meet the dawn. Where? Here. Why the fuck did we even come here? For a holiday. For a holiday? Fun, huh? You're going to laugh. Here. VD 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 Leg, leg The leg Can you move it? No Probably a fracture Come on 
I'm here now. Quiet. 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 Oh. Carefully. That's it. I'm not going any further. You'll go by yourself. So, look. That's far away. You see? There should be a bridge down there. You'll cross it. There must be people. Get up. Go ahead. Get up, I say. Go, I say. That's it. Do you want to leave a kid without a father? What kid? Ours. Come on, get up slowly. Don't let the situation control you. That's what dad always told me. Oh, oh. Why didn't you tell me about this before? I tried. Well, where are we going next? Look, there's a house there. Vlad, there's a house there. This is a summer hut of shepherds. Is this where Mara lives in winter? Damn it. Gently, please. Come on, A. Hey. Yes, I am. Yes. Quiet, quiet. So... <laughs> so... There's only one match left. Be careful. I know. You're clever. You dad, as a child, in the 6th, 7th grade, sent me to a tourist camp. And there they set fire to the forest at speed. There were even competitions. Did you win? And, so, the second place. So, do you think anyone is looking for us? Well, if the hotel noticed our loss and reported it to the Ministry of Emergency Situations, but with this weather... What? They will find it. They will find it. They'll find us. The owners. Is there anyone? Good afternoon. Kind. And where is the owner? So I went on business. He said it would be too late. Can I tell you what? Yes, he is not needed. 
Maria is a relative of everything as before. Lives. And what happened? I don't want to talk about her son Vlad. Did he call? Maybe he stopped by recently. Where is it? It was seven years ago. And even so. They don't communicate, and Maria herself sleeps well with her head. Why bother in vain? That's what you are. She has little time, but a lot to do, so go wake her up. I need to ask her. What are you standing for? Go, go. Here. Marietchka is a good fellow, a clever girl. Drink. Yeah. There's a boss from the district who came before you. He wants to talk. Why? Does he need it, then? He wants to ask about his son. Yeah. Comrade Chief. Come on in. Hello, Maria Dmitrievna. Hello, I said. Good afternoon to you. And what should I ask? Son, who didn't show up by chance? My son Stepushka died. No, I'm talking about the other one. I don't have another one. No, I don't have a hand. I have another one. The hostess. No, I have. No. What's wrong with him? I told you so. She's got a bad head. She's not herself. Something. I've been out of my mind for a long time. Have you shown it to the doctors? They showed it. So show others. Okay, I'll go. Be healthy. Go, go. I don't like sweets. You know, there's no other way. It was necessary to take Slavovka, too. Yes, we won't last that long. Come on, that's what you think. You know, all the obstacles in our head are made up. Aunt, the snow once went camping with my dad in May. Here, and it snowed at night. We wake up in the morning, everything is covered in snow. Such a beauty. It's cold, like here. For some reason I was afraid to go. Scared. And then? And then the snow melted. And we went. The snow won't melt here. Maybe I didn't give a very good example. I just wanted to say that in difficult situations, people die not from hunger and cold, but from despair. And we didn't come here to die. And once upon a time someone promised to show me the crystal peaks of the mountain. I wonder who it was? You. Crystal peaks are only in a fairy tale. So you're a liar. So he's a liar. Knock, knock, knock. Come in. Hello, Peter. And you don't get sick. That's great. Well, have a seat. And that's it. You repair your scrap metal. Listen, and your nephew, Ruddick Jr., stopped by by chance the other day. Oh, no. And why would that be? He's in town. If only he were here. He and his wife came to the local ski resort. Not deprived. We went for a walk yesterday and didn't come back. It's snowing in the mountains. Neither Vlad nor his wife answers the phone. Neither for breakfast nor for lunch, mind you, paid for, did not show up. I've been to his mate before you, 
he didn't show up there either. He arrived, so he didn't even call. Where else do you think they could have gone? I don't know, but you never know. Yes, there seems to be nowhere special. So it will thaw by spring. Oh, come on. Vladka can't freeze so easily in his native mountains. There will be. Maybe there will be. Beautiful. Do you really like it? You're beautiful. You're not delusional by any chance, are you? By the way, Nike, you're hot. Have you found out long ago? That you're hot. That she's pregnant. Before leaving. This is the first of January ever yelled after coffee, right? Yes. Right then. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. Well, I wouldn't like to, I didn't yell. You know, I was uncomfortable and lonely. I'm sorry, please. What am I like? But now you understand why I wanted to come here so much. Why did I want to meet your mother and relatives? Why? A child should have a grandmother. It's impossible. Why? Are you going to have dinner? Later. I'm going to relax a little. Tired? Drink something further. Vasily came by. Which one is it? From the police from the district. What does he want? He says they came from the city of Lad to work with his wife. The resort settled down to rest. And they've been gone since yesterday. Spitano. Look. Don't spoil her with your treatment. Disappeared, you say. Business. We have outlined the area where the missing Vladislav Elizaveta Rudici may be located, but due to difficult weather conditions, we cannot continue the search yet. As soon as the weather permits, we will immediately resume work. You know, as long as dad was alive, nothing could happen to me. Quite, quite. She knew how to anticipate everything, avoid problems. I can't do that. Me too. Well, what does it have to do with you? Really, 
what does it have to do with? I'm like that. Convenient son-in-law on errands. What do you want? Serve, bring. Well, stop it. Of course, the mutts didn't give a word. That's not what I meant at all. Of course. Well, who am I? The father of the heir to a disenfranchised inheritance with the sole task of prolonging the royal family. And our queen will rule an entire empire. Well, my task is done. Thank you all, everyone is free. The queen will rule the empire without unnecessary advisors. Well, maybe only with Uncle Roma. I never thought I married a greedy fool. Yes, I didn't even want to listen when they didn't say that you didn't marry me, but dad's money. And who told you, your photographer? That's it. I don't want to talk about it. And what are we going to talk about? About nothing. We're going to sleep. I'm sorry, please. I really am some kind of greedy fool. Hey. Is there anyone? Hey. God, what are you going to do here? Get out, this is my house. Although no, wait, wait, burn me, please, for the wine. I'm running out. Tell me, please, where did they go? And I remember you. You're a photographer, right? You're a photographer. I'm Nikita. I'm Lisa's classmate and friend. Where did they go? And I'm Karina, my mother, so to speak. And my daughter and her faithful are where they come from. So where's my wine? I need to know where she went. <laughs> you want to recapture her, right? I want to save her. Save, then. Okay, I know where they went. Only here we will go to rescue together. It's a helicopter. They're looking for us. What? What happened? Lisa, be careful.
Wait here. Five minutes, and then on the counter. Okay. I ordered a car at the ticket entrance. That's for the tickets and half for the taxi. Are you going to take a taxi in the mountains, too? If you don't like it, you can ski. You can do it, right? I can shoot better. Let's go show you something. There's a meter dripping on the taxi in general. We'll be in time. This is the device. And where did he come from? My late husband loved hunting and fishing very much. And he loved mountains, too. Only, che, the gasoline is yours. All right. Thank you, please. Have a nice day. Here, thanks. Now until tonight. Pyotr Ivanovich, to you. Well, of course, it is difficult for us to realize the fact that one of our largest clients is leaving us after so many years, so to speak. Thank you for coming to report this in person. Roman Evgenievich. I hope you understand that this decision was not easy for me. Yes, yes, I understand. I hope my decision won't affect our relationship. Well, what are you? Nothing personal, just business. Exactly. Ivan Nikolievich, come in, please. Damn it. The second client is behind. What's going on, Vanya? There are confirmed data on the leakage of important information to competitors. Now we are looking for a mole and a hole. What mole, Vanya? Have you seen enough spy movies? There was a helicopter, did you hear? The sky is clear, I trampled help in the snow. They will come back and find us for sure. A helicopter? Yeah. So, then you need a lapnik. The smoke will be thicker, they will find us faster. That's the right attitude. Come on. Let me touch your forehead. Oh, you're all hot. But it's fine. Here. The task is simple. List of employees with access. You take it, you work off everyone's mail. Incoming, outgoing, paper correspondence, calls. For a month. Wow simple. You have four days. All right. What are we looking for? Any mention of these companies and people. Got it? Got it. You can start now. It is necessary to tear the t-shirt into four parts. Be patient. Hush, 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 hush. So. Be 
patient, be patient, be patient, be patient, be patient. So, here you go. And I won't. Come on, come on. I don't want to. Why? So as not to die. Well, eat who they say. There won't be enough firewood for the night. I'm going to dial. Lisa. Be careful. The owners. Is there anyone? Hello. What do you need? And tell me, where is the Ruddick house here? What rudimentary? There's half a village of them here. Vlad Ruddick? Oh, really? Their house has been burned down for seven years. Vlad doesn't show up here. And his mother lives smartly in the house. With Lavrusha and Galina. You just passed the house. Here it is. I see. Thank you. Come on, hand me a can of gunpowder in the locker, Falcon. You said he was old, unfit. The money is gone. Oh, my God. Who's that there? Is it really Vladka? Lisa. Damn it. Ruddick? Vladka? Yes. They were friends with his father. With Mikhailov. Died. And Vladka and Maria's mother lives with us. In a related way. Their house burned down a long time ago. And who will put the new one? The husband died. The eldest burned down. What a horror. Fake and shield. Well, yes. They say that Balatka is the arson. The money was there from the owl. See how. And who's talking? Is that even true? And who knows? They didn't put him in jail. And how? How can you prove it? Here. Just before that, they had a fight with their brother. But then he threatened to kill Stepan. Everyone heard. So is someone looking for them at all? The road is being cleaned now. Everything was covered with an avalanche. And how to get to this resort in general? Where, you say, to get to? Well, to the village. This is where the resort is. Yes. Ah, so we'll get there. 
In the morning we will get on a snowmobile through the forest. Just gasoline. That's all. And we will pay how much you need. And this, of course. Yes, that's right. Well, the gasoline is there. That's it. Just so that right away. Forward, as they say, money. Well, the fire was burning, but it was necessary to cover everything with this snow. Everything, everything. Quiet, quiet, quiet. It's an accident. Something could happen to everyone. Let's go to sleep. The morning of the evening is morning. Oh. We need to figure out how to go further. Let's freeze and there's no more food. We have to wait for rescuers. We won't get out in this snow. And how long are we going to wait? A day? A week? A month? No. We're leaving tomorrow morning. Sonia, found just for you. It remains only to understand how you are piled up on them here. Lisa, there will be a bridge further down the valley. You cross the river, there will be an expensive farm. I'll stay here, and you go. It gets dark early. Haven't you heard? I'm telling you, I found it with us. We'll get out, well. And the horse? There is also a horse. You can't do it. You can't, Lisa. Yes, I'm healthy. No, I wish I hadn't said anything at all. You have no idea who you're risking it for. Who do you want to save? The father of his child. Is that enough of an argument? Everyone, get up. Come on. You know, your photographer was right. I married you for convenience. I wanted to make a quick career in a test company. Why are you telling me this? Well, wouldn't you like me to know more? What else? My past? My family? In my native village, everyone believes that it was I who burned down the hut and killed my own brother. My mother cursed me and doesn't want to see me. That's why I didn't want to come back here. You. Did you really do that? People won't just talk like that. People are not going to say that I'm asking you. Is it true or are you lying? Think for yourself. So that's it. We'll get out together. And then I'll decide. I can't get out without you. I need your help, okay? Don't forget the tea. Hello. Are you Maria? Maria. And I'm Nikita. Very nice. 
You have such an interesting smell here. And so it's a tick. She collects herbs for me. I'm not sleeping well. My heart is pounding. Good morning. Morning. And what about us? A multi-day expedition. So we go to the mountains. And anything can happen there. And I wanted to ask you about Vlad. It is true that he is his brother. Well. Where's the photographer? No. Oh, you're a non-Christ. Why are you disturbing the patient? Go ahead. Quiet, quiet, Marika. Now, I'm going to have a cup of tea. Come on. And bye-bye. We're both going to die. Shut up. I won't shut up. But I know. You want it later, when you get me out. Be ashamed. With his nobility. To show that here, I pulled out this scum on myself. Yes. But the scum does not want to be pulled out. What a stupid fool. Stupid. And even dumber. Do you know why? I cheated on you. Do you know where I cheated on you? In the office of Nikolai Borisovic himself. And you know who? With your stepmother. Under the scotch whiskey. Yes, go away, go away. That's right, dear. You will succeed. Come on with me or something. Love Russia. Sit down. Borrow a snowmobile. I can't. Out. I'm taking them. Tourists or something. Oh, no. Either relatives, or else. The seventh water on the jelly, the wife of Vladka Radishcha. Alarmed, came to look for. They'll wait. Where will they wait? Gone. Listen here. They're on the mountain, where the boat with his wife, the house was removed. A corpse was found nearby. The woman is young. And now, apparently, Latkin has a wife. Got it? Ой, ты солнце ясное, дай мне ответ.
Pyotr Andreevich, I called you right away for old time's sake, then I realized that you were retired, and I've already dialed the police, they should drive up if they make their way through the snow. Well, I see, and how did you find it? Our guests. Let's go for a walk. A woman comes running dead in the forest. Thank you, Anton. Hello. Kind. Have a seat. My name is Pyotr Andreevich Yasek. I'm a local precinct officer, well, although I'm a former one. The police are aware, they are already on their way, but you know yourself, the roads are blocked. Can you show me where you found the body? This is the unit just for our places. Capitalists know how to do it. And then our Bobak is a stool with a stool. And how much did they take? I don't remember anymore. 30,000. Oh, is it? Euro. Where did such money come from? They earn money. But, of course, it can be earned in different ways. And how did you know that it was Elisabetta Ruddick? Do you know each other? What? Oh, no, no. Her boarding pass fell out of her jacket pocket. The name was there. Where's the ticket? He stayed in place. Where is she? Where's Lisa? Wait a minute. Come on, show me where this place is. All right. Wait here. It's not her. It's not her. Who is this? And you, Pyotr Andreevich, what are you doing here? Who's with you? These are relatives of the missing. Holy shit. Did you have time? Identified? Yes. Kashina Miroslava. I didn't understand. And where is Ruddick? Looking for. There, you say. We need to get into the house. What? Which house? Well, which Vlad and Lisa rented in a chalet is. There just might be something there, traces of a quarrel, some clues. But it's not for me to explain to you, after all. We must hurry, she may be alive. Come on. Why did you come back? Go away, please. You don't need to be here. It's on the bloodline that Mara will come to my soul. And bite his throat with iron teeth. Listen. Give me the key to the room where Ruddick and his wife were. 
a chalet? Well, it's him, otherwise our people will soon raid. Only for a short time, Pyotr Andreevich, you know yourself. See, with you two? No, I'm alone. Now, I'm the keys only. Where did this murdered ticket Melissa come from? Maybe Lisa was robbed? Exactly. This maid. She stole her jacket, money, while Vlad took Lisa to the mountains. Sherlock Holmes, too. Can I have a coffee, please? Yes, of course. Just be quick, okay? I'm a fly. Also, when was the last time you saw these missing tourists? So on the day of the holiday, and then the police told everything. They came to dinner in costumes, but they were going to a masquerade. A woman in a light dress, and wings attached to her sheepskin coat, well, like an angel. An angel with wings, then. Here you go. There are no more gingerbread or liqueur. There is herbal tea. Let's try it. Well, and how? Like hay. There should be a bridge soon, maybe we'll meet someone. I'd like to make it before dark. Come on. Come on. Come on, drop it. It's still empty. I told you to wait outside, don't come in here. Excuse me, I just wanted to let you know. I think Vlad wanted to. More precisely, Vlad wants to remove Lisa. What does it mean to remove? Well, to kill. That is. You see, it's all about the will. Lysen's dad is a very rich man. And he died and left everything to Lisa. And maybe they had a conflict. I wouldn't even be surprised if Vlad killed that maid. What's her name? Miroslav, in my opinion, yes. So she came in here, I saw something, maybe how they quarreled, Lisa said that they did not often quarrel before leaving, it's not for nothing that people say that Ruddick killed his own brother, fools speak who know nothing, she was making up the hell out there, and you go ahead, leave the room, come on, come on. So, everyone, go ahead yourself. I think I'll go. We'll settle up. So, let's settle it. No, it was an advance. Still need to. So, how much more do you need? The same amount. Why can't they be found in any way? Here it was cramped around. It hasn't been snowing for a long time. What are you arguing about? I drove you. Well, I have to go. I didn't understand. Where to? I have a case. If it's about money, we'll pay.
How much will you give? Well, this is my money in general. Wait. Not there then. Looking for. I'm here now. Excuse me, can I talk to you for a minute? I would like to talk to you about the missing relatives of Elizabeth Vladislav. A relative? Almost. I'm a friend. Come on. I've been telling you all this, Peter. I forgot how to use my patronymic. To your colleague. Yes, I understand that things are all in place and there are no signs of a fight, but they could have had a verbal fight. Are things all in place? Yes. And how do you know? But we were in this shawl. And? Excuse me, who let you in there? This PTR let us go there. Pyotr Andreevich, then. Thank you. Everything you say is very useful for the investigation. Wait, we've met. With Lisa many years ago. At school. We saw each other recently. And realized that nothing had passed. She has always loved only me. She wanted to divorce him. Maybe she told him about it. And he decided to kill her. Well, because in a divorce, he gets nothing. Everything was hers. Photographer, are you coming? This Love Russia has already lost his whole brain there. I'm coming. I'm coming. Hi, Anya. Oh, great, Uncle Peter. Well, how was the holiday? Yes, what? The boys are like they're having fun for the holidays. Yes, they dumped a tent with liqueur for Oksana, a neighbor at the bazaar. And whose are these? Ah, uh, Grishki, prefects, sons, red devils. Drunks then walked around the village, frightened tourists, whipped them with a whip. And the case was hushed up, paid off. Of course. You know, it's good that everything turned out this way. Whatever it was, everything will be different from now on. How is it different? I don't know. More honest, probably. Hey. Someone was there. Where? There's no one there. You imagined it. Come on. You're hot. Are we still a long way from this bridge? Hardly. We'll get there before evening. Oh, I'll try. Get some rest for now. Careful with you. Oh, Vasily Alexievich, I barely got there. Thank you. As always on top. I wish everyone would do their job so quickly. This is for your tea. Thank you. From the road is the very thing. Thank you, Ludmila Sergeevna. Oh, yeah, I'm leaving.
The train is slowed down at the sidings, and the locals agree with the conductors to open the car and let them off. And the nearest exit. Him. Another trip. About what in general? Vlad could have gotten off earlier. We need to question the conductor again. Maria Rodic, is everything still the same? Lives. What happened? I want to talk to her about you. Did Vladi call her? Maybe he stopped by recently. Where is it? It was seven years ago. And even then, they don't communicate. Visor. Well, what's with the redhead? Hello, young people. Hello. Then it dawned on me that someone was on holiday. They discharged themselves with devils, drunks walked around the village, scared tourists. The stalls at the fair were demolished. You don't know who it was, do you? Some kind of freaks in any way. Well, if you find out, tell them that someone will get into the department, one damn thing. And my father was the ringleader and there will be very big troubles. I hope you got the hint. Someone will be unlucky, yes. And what do we have to do with it? And despite the fact that if you met a young couple by chance, a woman in a sheepskin coat, in a white dress with wings. Well, sort of like an angel. No, you haven't. Not. There are a lot of mummers here. Well, clearly, they didn't see it, so they didn't see it. Then you will have to answer for the stalls. Now, just a second, guys. Wait. Wait. Well. Well, in short. Well, we scared these winged ones, but a little. Where was it? Can you show me? I can. Here. Well, it's kind of here, yes. How was it? Come on, come on, tell her. Well, well, we just wanted to make a joke. Well, and this chick started yelling something and got scared, probably. Then what? Her. She got in. He followed her. Which way? They're like. Or there. I honestly don't remember. It was dark. And who was? Me, Eugene, Serega, Kolya. Bogdan was still a Lishak. Wait, which Bogdan? Is it Brisk? Well, yes, probably. The same adult man. Why should he run around with the boys? Well, it's a holiday. What else to do? Have fun. Lisa, how are you? Let me. Come on. Yes, give it to me. I know more than two dozen knots without you. This node, by the way, is called Bobby.
laurels, where, and these relatives. Lavrusha was taken to the mountains on a snowmobile. How long ago? Yeah, about two or three hours. Interesting. Print everything. And let's just do the last one. We hacked the personal email of everyone who had access to the information drain. This is where we found the freak. So what's criminal here? I don't understand. Well, an account in Cyprus. What's the big deal here? Who doesn't have an account in Cyprus? I don't have one. That doesn't mean anything either. There is one very interesting line in this Cyprus bank statement. This is a payment for opening an offshore account. I made a request through my channels. Got an answer. In Latra, Yudish is the beneficiary of the offshore company Cype Du Consal Trade. And this company, in turn, took a competitor in a contract, to which our large customers are fleeing. He's either a fool or... Call me the head of the legal department. Here it is. Hey! We have to walk further. We'll go through the rift, then we'll go again. I'll go ahead and wait for you there. I will follow you, it will be easier this way. And how far is it to Spank? Well, 300 meters, maybe more. Hey, 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 how much more? Well, maybe a kilometer. So 300 meters or a kilometer? Listen, that's enough already. Get out. So Major Sereshchuk requested the case. He even chased me to the neighboring district for one. What kind of business is this? The tourist was killed six or seven years ago. The cold weather filled up the roads, and our Vasily just had to take it out and put it down. He even gave his bean to make it faster. Clearly. Thank you, Ludmilla. You're welcome. It's not Vlad. If he smokes, it's expensive French, at $30 a pack. What a fool. Why is that? Such a lot of money for poison. So, are we going or not? Half a pension for a pack of cigarettes. The car is like a house. Is this what you need to do to earn such money? Listen, didn't you say who Igor will go? I want to check one more place. Maybe they're there. Sit down already.
I'm going to treat you to my signature one now. Have a seat. So I'm on duty. So it's like vitamins, so as not to get sick. I do it myself on the grass. Here. Eh. Fragrant. I wanted to talk to you about your ex-neighbor again. Which one is it about? About Vlad Mihailovich Kinsman. Last time you said that Vlad Ruich came here seven years ago to see his mother. Well, yes. It was on the anniversary of Stepan's death. Yes. It's been a year since I shoved with the famous. Come on, ladies. Hey, mom. Barely got to the station, the bus broke down, minibuses. Go away, go away, you murderer. What are you doing? I didn't warn you anything. Well, don't show up sometimes. Go to Peter. That's where he sits. Maria could not calm down for a long time then. She has become very weak with nerves. Thank you, mistress. And where does your spouse disappear? Can you keep track of your spouse? Well, come on. Who's Shack? Shepherds live all summer. Cattle are grazed, cheese is cooked. Does anyone live in winter? They live. Animals. Look, someone was here. This is Lisa. She drew it. Phew, she's alive, then. They were here. We were there this morning. Blood. It means someone is injured. We need to call rescuers. Damn it. Where are you, huh? Well? Neither inside nor outside. Just calm down. They spent a normal time here. They drew pictures, drank liqueur, and had a snack with gingerbread. Let's follow the trail now. They couldn't have gone far. It will get dark soon. We need to quickly, otherwise at night in the mountains, and even in winter, it will be hard. What happened? Is it broken or something? We'll do it now. What's that, huh? How long will it last? So, I'll go ahead, and you catch up. Go, go. Only here's how. I'm not going to save you. Your life. I only agreed to let you down, to look for these relatives of yours. There was no agreement to save. Listen, calm down already, huh? Half an hour won't make the weather for us. Now let's fix up and go look for your Juliet.
Can you hack Ruddick's personal email? We'll try. I need to know for sure. Hack it. We need to get the maximum amount of information about what this bastard vulture managed to drain from investment technology. The main thing is to keep everything a secret, both from investors and from customers, okay? That's right. Work, Vanya, work. You know what the hell it is. Yes. Roman Evgenievich, Alexander Dashkov, General Director of Invest Technology, is calling you. Connect. Wait. Interesting movie. Connect it. All right. Is it broken? Oh, my God. And what, where to now? There's nowhere to go now. There may be people on the other side. We need to shout. Hey. Somebody. Hey. Help me. People. People. A man. The sky is bad. Why? It's going to be cold. It is necessary to go to shelter. You can hide somewhere here. Vlad! There are footprints here. Here. Someone's here. Someone is there. People. People. Hey. We're here. People. People. Hey. Hello, Vasily Alexeevich. Greetings to veterans. Only I'm already leaving. As they say, come back tomorrow. I can't tomorrow. Have you noticed that Miroslava has all her legs cut off? Is he married? What? A joke. Do you want a tangerine? I'm not joking. Miroslav was chased through the forest for a long time, whipped on the legs. And the day before, Vladka and his wife were scared by devils with whips. Whips, devils. I understand you're upset. Your relative was killed. And believe me, I'm doing everything I can to find the killer. And soon we will close three cases in one fell swoop. I really was. I admit it. Stepan, it seems, was flunked by his brother. And set the house on fire. And your niece. I'm sorry. Did he kill her too? Wait a minute. Why Vladka? What does Miroslav have to do with it? Oh. It's this relative with a camera who told you. This relative is not a relative at all, but a lover. Our millionaire. And a tourist in the 2014th year. She also has such holes. What's the connection here? Did you know that your nephew visited his mother on the day of the murder of this tourist? Splattered with mud. Do you know when? On the anniversary of Stepan's death. But that doesn't mean he killed. What evidence? Wait a minute. And about the tourist, about these holes? I'm warning you for the last time. 
You don't have the authority to go where you shouldn't. Why in the chalet that Rudish was removed, did he poper and dragged a relative? Do you take me for an idiot? You're poking around in the cases behind my back on my desk. Go home already. The matter is settled. After all, was your idea about Vladislav Oridovich? All that remains is to find your nephew and send him to jail before he kills his wife. It's certainly not too late already. That's it, I don't have time. The working day is over. Damn it, yes, it is not visible, wait for what? Bring it here. Why the hell did he agree to go with you? It was necessary. Okay. Let's spend the night here. If possible, we will obey. Come on, give me a hand. And you yourself said that it's dangerous to spend the night in the mountains at night. Tell me what you are. Okay, stop. You have pledged to help us with the search for Lisa. And now what? Are we going to spend the night in this hut? Did you take the money? We have to walk. Here it is. I agreed to look for two, not four. I won't go to the mountains at night. And I don't advise anyone. I'm going to fix the pipe. It's time to light the fire, otherwise it's cold. Do you have a flashlight? Come on. There is. Only I'm not going anywhere either. Bastards. Vlad. Vlad. Darling, what are you? Well, 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 get up like this. Please. Please, please, please. Come on, come on. Just a little more, please. Come on a little bit more. We'll come somewhere. Here. Come on. Here. Over there. There's light. Do you hear? There's light. Here. And where is this one of yours? He's not mine. Is he gone or something? But where will he go? Walking around. I wanted to go look for my beloved myself. Come on. Everyone wants to take her hubby's place. I don't understand something. Can you explain? What's there to explain? And why did you really come here? To help anyone. Is anyone there? Hey. Hey.
Who would have known that Vlad would become a rich man? And besides, the latch was running there with a latch. As you will not meet, everyone with a book in their hands. I must have read something. Smokes expensive poison. Rents an elite house. Who would know? Where did he get so much money from? He doesn't have any money. As there is no? Is that all? And yet everything belongs to him. Money and houses and a firm. It's all hers. And your Vlad is just a temporary phenomenon. Tell your wife, wives. And it should have been mine. Wonderful. Wonderful. Now, now. I'll bring the snow, we'll warm the water. All right. Quiet, quiet, quiet. Be patient a little. Vlad is worse. He needs to go to the hospital. Bogdan, have you called the rescuers? It's still early. You mean early? You said you'd go in the morning. He said. Then I'll go. Lisa. Quiet, quiet, quiet. Thank you. I was yesterday. Quiet, quiet, everything later, later. Save your strength. I would like some water. Water. I'll get some fresh ones right away.
Stayapka with these bites. Tourist Merka. What was it beaten with? Repulsed from the left. Probably left-handed. What do you think, Blackie? And Bogdanka? Now. It's sweet now, and yours will be ready. Where should I write the number, Uncle Petia? And, Stipa, look here, here, right here, here, yeah. Well, you, Bogdanka. With his left hand, like a bark paw. Let me help you. I can do it without a number, and you can crash without a number. A thousand. Right in the head in the palm. A thousand. A thousand. A thousand. Bogdan Ka Lavrishin. Bogdan. I've been sitting in the mountains for several years almost without leaving. And now I've come for a holiday. Thank you. Here you go. It's coming soon. Bogdan, did you get through? The phone is dead. So charge up. With what? Well, electricity. There is no generator. That's it, then we need to go and call for help. Don't go. There will be a blizzard. I'll go myself. I said don't go. Dan, what are you doing? Let me go. Let go. Let go. Let go. Let go. Let go. Now. Let's get out now. What are these two people? Lisa. Run to the fence, there will be a hunting path down there. Knurled, you'll see. Run along it, you will bring out the roads. I'll be quick. I'm here now. Can you be more careful somehow? You're not fucking driving grass.
help me. Wait. Wait. Turn it around. Lisa. 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 Liska. Wait, 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 wait. Liska. Thank God, Lord. Liza, I knew. I knew, Liza. Where are you? Me. Where are you from? Me. Nikita, Vlad is there. Where? Vlad's there, please. He needs to be sewn on with help. Karina, you. You're Vlad there. And there's Bogdan. He's a maniac. He almost killed me. Please, please, let's go. Please call the police. There is no connection here. Well, let's go see what kind of maniac he is. Come on. Proker launched the news about your disappearance. Remember our Prashka, right? Here he is working in the law enforcement agencies now. Well, sit down, sit down, sit down. So I came here, and I found this grandfather. No one agreed to come here. They said the roads were blocked up, like bad weather. Can you imagine? And then the woman's corpse was found. I was so worried, but I knew you were alive. Uranus is coming. Lizka, we'll have to wait it out. In the village where Vlad was born, I learned a lot about him. Well, let's go already. So we're off. Hard is the main thing. Hold on. Hold on. And what to take from him? He's a seizure. He won't let Vladka lie. Well, 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 well. In the eighth grade, he fell off a horse. So something happened to his head. Sometimes, the weather is fine, but sometimes, it's going to pour in like this. And you hit him on the head. And what did you want, Vladka? Bogdan has been friends with Stepka since childhood, the brother of your faithful. So he thinks, like many in the village, that Balatka set fire to the house, where Stepka burned down. So an eclipse came over him, a fit. Well, never mind, we'll drink the broth now and calm down. And in the morning he will wake up and forget everything. Why does everyone think that Vlad set fire to the house and killed his brother? Many at the wake of their father heard Vladka threaten that he would kill someone with Chopka. FR Our guy is really bad. Well, nothing, now we will do for Vladka gulls to remove the heat. And he won't scald his throat like that. He's familiar. Drink up, drink up. When will it be possible to go? God only knows that. Come on, just be careful. Well done. Just a little more. Why are you crazy? What are you doing? He will be calm. He's not a beast for you to sit on privies. Yes, he's a little bit of me. Do you know what he wanted? He wanted to make a joke. It was a joke. Have you heard? So I am sure that it is you who are guilty. Well, Vasily Alexeevich, if you finish this case, do you know what will happen? The Revealed series? No. 
it will turn out two holes. On shoulder straps, under the stars of the lieutenant colonel. Thank you, comrade colonel. Will I, will I justify? I hope so. Excuse me, for God's sake, just a minute, come on. What, Pyotr Andreevich, have you fucked up? What are you doing here? Can't you see who's sitting in the hall? You, Basenka, don't yell at me, and my eyesight will be better than yours. And there is no need to cock up here. I'll tell you what. If you hadn't closed the case on Stepan Kin then, as an accident, then two more, maybe, were alive. And now four more can be added to them. Very influential and famous people. What do you want? I want you to authorize a search of Lavroboyko. Both at home and on his loan. You know what? Get the fuck out of here, Pinkerton. Searches. And where are your instruments? Well, forks and knives. Take it on the shelf. Let me help you. No, thanks. Here you go. Wow. A rarity. So this is ours, grandfathers. Give me that. What are you, a guy? Yes, there used to be such in every house. When I was a kid, I used to eat with such a fork. Let go, it hurts. Bogdan, let go. Let her go, to whom you told. Come on. Bring some firewood for the night. Go, I say. Well, are you scared or something? Come on, go sit down, eat. If I was a little younger, I'd be worried too. He's never seen anyone like you in his life. But he doesn't know how to approach. Rude. Well, I hope at least it doesn't bite and doesn't get rabies. Hello, neighbor. Are you crazy, or what? It's night outside. The laurel is back. Eh, so in the mountains, with tourists. Yeah. He took two townspeople into the mountains, into a blizzard. So alone for a day, not a sound, not a ghost. It's you who are silent. Laver knows what he's doing. I don't meddle in his business. What's your emergency? And where is Bogdan? Something I haven't met for a long time. He hunts in the mountains. Looks after the winter quarters. Also in the mountains. Show me. How are you feeling? Thank you. That's better. All right. Uncle Lavrish, why did you untie Bogdanka? And what if the attack starts again that night? If they had left him until morning, it would have been calmer. Who is calmer? Everyone. Calm down to those who have a clear conscience. And what are you driving at? I didn't understand something. 
I see you've lost your fever from the jackdaw's potion. And the compress worked. Look, you're not very good. Take care of your strength. And then no one knows how much longer we have to sit here. And yet, Vlad, but how did you manage to get out of such shit? And there was an investigation, and the evidence is all against you. And you got away with it over the corpse of your brother and went on. Nick. No, I'm just wondering how a simple village guy can be so brainwashed by everyone, and most importantly, everything is being conducted. Listen, shut up. Who are you anyway? Who am I? I'm the one whose place you took. I'm in my place, but here you are. You just left and forgot her. You took her away from me. Shut up, both of you. Took it away, threw it. Am I a doll for you? I'm with Vlad because that's what I decided. And because Vlad was with me and my dying father, not you. Only you know, you and your father made a mistake. He just wanted to become rich by getting married successfully. Yes, and then he realized that everything belongs to you. And what? And if he killed his brother easily, then his wife just spit, right? You scum. What? What? Shouted. It's not because of you. No, I can hear it. Are you living well, neighbors? Well, here's a new TV, a washing machine. To explain, the roof was repainted, the chairs are new. Envy. Peter is a big Greek. I told you that Lavra is doing well in the city. Yes, you might think that everyone in the city, from young to old, is walking in your skins. Can you tell me the buyer's contacts? Store addresses, invoices, receipts, eh? It's all Lavrashino farms. I'm more into borscht and cutlets. Where are you going? Take a walk. You don't have to go there. But I have to. Excuse me. To the toilet. There's a toilet for you. And there is no need to go there. Buran, you can get lost. What? Right here. In the hall. The Middle Ages. Damn it. Well, do you at least talk there or sing? Do you want me to pour some liqueurs? Yes, I'm afraid to drink your potion. Since when? Are you offending me, neighbor? Don't be afraid, I have everything curative. Yeah, so much time you treat Maria, but Lysia does not become her. I've told you how many times, you need to show it to the doctors. They showed, they showed your Maria. When? I don't remember anything. Maybe there's a cork in there. What recipes, eh? There is. Everything is there. Well, show me. It's a long search. Why are you so worried about her? Can't you calm down in any way? Mishka beat you, beat you. And life seems to be behind you, but you're still drying up. All around the young goat jump skip. Yes, you're lying all about doctors, Galina. You'd better tell me. Lavrusha was going to Bogdan. And what's it to you? Of course I was going to. To my own son. Bad. What's wrong? Yes, everything is bad. Ride home, you little goat.
The temperature is rising again. Have a drink. I won't drink. Vlad. Yes me now. A little bit. Yes, there is no sense at all. Come on. Hey. Hey. Will you be a seed? Hey. Bogdash. Leave the girl alone. Just tired, not in the mood. I've wound up cartridges here. And pigtails, and buckshot. Yes. The gunpowder is old, there may be a misfire. Maybe you have something for pain and fever. An axe. Well, something antipyretic, antibiotics, maybe. We don't keep that. Our mother treats us with herbs and decoctions. It's you who swallow city pills by handfuls. That's why you get sick. That's enough. Hang up. No, 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 leave it, please. Well, whatever you say, only kerosene here for a quarter of an hour. Do you understand that Vlad is worse off? He needs to go to the hospital urgently. Your herbs, they are already all, do not help. And we're sitting here like, do I have to do something, well? How much will you pay for your salvation? What? I won't thank you, of course. And how old are you? Three hundred thousand dollars. But I don't have that kind of money. Well, they said you were a millionaire. It is necessary to go to the bank and order. It's not that simple. Well, so, like Brugge Steichen, we're going to the village with you, to the bank. There you will order money, then give it to me for saving. But you will also write a paper that this is so, well and so. I gave thanks. And now listen to me, the savior. First we'll take Vlad to the hospital. He urgently needs help, is that clear? Didn't you hear that? You and I will go, they will stay here. And Bogdanka will guard them, so as not to be tormented. I know you city people, promise, and then. He took his hands away from her. What a bastard you are. Lisa, get away from him, we'll go ourselves tomorrow. We can manage without these rescuers. Look how you sang. And who am I? And who sheltered your mother? Who feeds her and doesn't hurt her, huh? Yes, my jackdaw, with her, as with a small child. And I don't take the last money, do I? Hello, uncle, and what do we have to do with it? Yes, I'm not going to stay here with this maniac son of yours. And no one asked you, relatives. And what are you mutating here at all? Stop. That's enough. Let me stay, and let the others go. Why keep them? Here, that's right. Vladka. And you didn't hit your head, but when did you fall? If someone did not hear, I repeat. Hang up. Lisa. Nikita is lying. I would never have raised my hand against you or my brother. How did your mom end up with this Lavrusha? Galina is Lavrusha's wife. This is my mother's cousin, Tet. It turns out that you really are one big family.
Stepan was the beloved son and hope of the family. My brother. I see this book fig. Yes, the brute. This is a librarian. Come on, take it away. You're an asshole, Stepan. Stupid asshole. What did you say? What did you hear? I'll give you such a goat. Ah, oh, it hurts. Come on, let's go. Split up, I said. You said yourself that we cleaned the cattle before lunch. And this one is shirking. He got carried away with a book. He says he doesn't want to. So you don't want a job. Do you want to eat? Do you want to live in warmth? Why does everyone think that you killed your brother? You know, I decided to leave when I was a kid. And after my father's death, there was money left. I asked Stepan to give me a part to move to the city, to enter the institute. But he took everything and said that everything would go to the farm. Money. In order to spend everything in the city, all that my father earned with his labor. I need somewhere to live. Look for a job, prepare for admission. I am ready to pay all the money back gradually. How will he pay? We know such people. He skips everything and comes running back. I'm not asking for a favor. I demand my share. It's my money. You know that very well. It's not your money. And you have no rights here, you fucking drone. How can you? They didn't have time to bury my father. You. At the wake, we got into a fight again. Word for word, a fight. It was said that her heart screamed that I would kill him. I don't remember it at all. But they also began to gossip that they could. And I argued, I killed my brother's hut. Have you tried talking to your mom? Yes, I came several times. But something happened to her head. She doesn't recognize me at all. Or doesn't want to find out. I sent money for her once a month. Through Love Russia. And well, look how Love Russia turned out. Shut up. You give me a headache. He's restless. Sleep already. Have you been drinking too much? Do you know what time it is? And where is in danger? Do you hear? Lopka and his wife and these two are from the city. I know where they might be. We need to send people there urgently. Well, that's it. You crossed over. You got me. Yes, it's you who got me, Bajia. If you don't get your ass off the couch now, I'll make sure that your head is torn off for negligent inaction. Is that clear? In general, five minutes for you to get dressed. Come on. Listen, me. I am a completely random person in this story. I'm Lisa's former classmate. But I found out what happened and decided to help. I don't have any money. I'm in debt all over. There is a camera, dear. There is an apartment, a dacha. I can go back to the city and send money there. Hey, classmate, shut up already, okay? And I forgot to ask you. <laughs> Look, he's dangerous. He's crazy, I don't want to stay with him. One more word, and you really will know who is really dangerous here. Go to sleep. Seva. What's stopping us from going? The weather summary gets in the way. Listen, your summaries are like horoscopes. Pyotr Andreevich, instructions are instructions. Seva, I'm begging you, what's the instruction? Well, let's wait until morning. If the forecast is not confirmed, we will move out at dawn. Okay, I'm at the marshals. Extinguish it. Happily. Damn mountains. Everyone. Yes, a snowmobile. Pyotr Andreevich, come in the morning.
Where are you going? Well, but on her. Dad, she called herself, she wanted to. I won't. How are you? I won't. Thank you. I won't. Dad, that's it, it's bitter. I won't drink, I won't. Well, it's bitter. Excuse me. Nothing. Now they will drink tea, calm down. I was outside, the snow has passed, so in two hours, Lizavita, we will be in the village with you. Lisa, Karina, get ready quickly and leave here. Vlad, Vlad, I'm begging you, please. You're weak. Wait, Bogdan, wait. You're a weakling. Not like with Temka. It's scary. See how. You see, Bat, if it wasn't for your greed, he would have ripped open my belly. Bogdan. Come on. Don't be stupid. Give me the gun. Who am I telling? Come on, drink tea, sit down. Take a look. Open your eyes. Look at her. Look at me. What? She's locked up. He locked it. He's coming. Calm down. There should be a basement here. Basement. There has to be somewhere. Where? This. Where is this one? Come on, come on, come on. Well, well, what is it? There is. There is. There's a window there. All right. Come on, honey, get up, get up. You're in the attic. Come on, hurry up. Throw the Revnog Proshinal. Okay, please, get up. Come on, I knew. Well, where? Are we going to play hide and seek? Don't start it. Let's do it later. Come on. This way. Well, well, stop it.
Oh, shit. Where are we going anyway? Upstairs. Very informative. Come on, push it already. Nika, please. Be careful. One. One. Oh, oh, oh. Yes, are you standing? Nikita, come on. Go ahead and pull. Where are we going anyway? Does anyone know? Upstairs. Look, maybe it's already appeared. Hot as a stove. We need to get upstairs soon. Where to? On Kirikin Mountain. Well, it's idiotic to go up. He still doesn't regret dragging this body with him. What are you offering me? Sit and wait. We need to go up. We need to find a connection and ask for help. I don't understand why we left the hut at all. Let's go back before it's too late. Or are you afraid of corpses? But no, you're not afraid, if you drag a Clyatina with you there. Shut up already. And I call a spade a spade. Maybe there. Maybe there will be fishing. I'll go check it out. I'm with you. Oh, my god, it's so cold, huh? Well, what is it?
Seva, reception. Yes, Pyotr Andreevich. They could have been here. They probably saw that the bridge was broken and left. I see. We continue the search. I'm an old fool. Of course. The main thing, guys, is that you are there. There is no connection. Return the blanket to Lado. I won't return it. I'm cold, but he doesn't need it anymore. Don't pay attention. This is his petty revenge. They have their own scores with Vlad. And what kind of accounts can I have with this redneck? I didn't give a damn about him. What kind of fool am I? Of course, she's a fool. You let yourself get your head screwed up by this one. No, I'm the one who let you mess with my brain. You know, my dad was right. It's good that you left then, and it's a pity that I came back. I'm here, actually, because of you. It's a pity, you shouldn't have. And I'm sorry that your daddy appreciated his princess so cheaply. What? And I'm sorry, I didn't tell you everything. Your dad gave me money to fly to London, to Paris, to Zydemir, anywhere. Just don't lie to me now. Where did you get the money for the trip? Mom was covered in loans, so I'm sorry, it's true. Listen, either you shut up now, or I'll shoot you. And what is this, solidarity, right? And you tell your daughter how happy you were when you found out about her disappearance. What a bastard you are. Got out of here. <laughs> hmm? With pleasure. I'll leave you in your brilliant company. So, you know. Compared to your relatives, I'm an angel. Goodbye, may love. Goodbye. Hey. Hey. I'm here. Hey. I'm here. Hey. Hey.
pay. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Quiet. Do you hear that? The dead don't ride snowmobiles, so... See? Is anyone alive? This way. We're here. Help me. Well, did you miss me? Why is he alive, beast? Guns. Come on, shoot. Damn it. Okay, let's play. Well, stop running from me. Come to me. Come on, come on, please, come on. I said, come here. Are you hit? He's gone. You got it, Karinaka, he's gone. How did this happen? I am. Why is he alive, beast? Karinaka, you're doing great. Well done, come on. Damn it, the fraction is a small picosan. His face drooped, that's all. Karanaka, please, Laris, now, we have to go. Here. Here, buckshot is what you need. Now, now, now. We need to move. It is necessary. Come on, come on. Seva, how do you hear me? This is Pyotr Yasik, over. Yes, Pyotr Andreevich, what have you got there? A corpse was found in the winter quarters. Report to the police and come here yourself. 
one of the missing. The owner of the winter quarters, Lavrboyko. Don't go into the house before the police. I'm in square 434311. Our way are in deep ass. In general, Seva is in touch. The year returns. He left. He'll find us anyway. Let him just try. There is, there is, there is a connection, there is a connection, there is. No, no, how not, he's dead. The phone will die and then we will die too. No, quiet, quiet. It can't be. Come on. Damn it, damn it. So we have to go. Go ahead. He's not going to let go that easily. I'll hold him up. No, I am. I'm not going without you. Listen up. Let me do something good for once in my life. Don't think about yourself now. Think about your child, okay? If I go, I'll only go with you. Did you hear what your photographer said? I was really very enraged by Nikolai's decision and his handout. Anyway, I wanted you to die here in these mountains, and then I would have become the next heir. Karina, you're only saying that because you're angry. Lisa, I really loved your father very much. And he really wanted a son. Karen, please. And now Matveka is out there somewhere. With dad. Karina, Karina, please, let's go, okay? Come on. Karina. Wait, wait, wait. Well, you've waited, my good one. Be patient. Damn it. Oh, my God. 
Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Help me. Somebody help me. Vlad. Vlad. Vlad, darling. Morning is coming, do you hear? Look at me, do you hear? All right. That's it. Well done, well done. We'll move on soon. Come to me. Yes. All right. All right. Come on. Let's lie down a little. Rest a little and go. Just talk to me, please. Tell me. Tell me. Tell me about the Crystal Peaks. It's a fairy tale. Tell me. My grandmother told me that if you have a kind heart, pure thoughts. Then at dawn you will see crystal peaks. For a moment, the mountains become transparent, as if made of crystal, and show you the future. And at this moment, the stars descend from the sky to light up the path and make you happier. A star. Smooth. Alive, thank God. Seva. Seva, I found them. Good afternoon. Hello. Well, did you get the frost? It's nothing. We survived the Yuletide and it's not far until spring. Well, yes. How's the baby? Great. You know, I even think he likes it here. However, I was sick and nauseous in the city all the time. Everything is fine here, 
even in the forest. You saved us. I, he's messed up again. I didn't do anything special. Am I interrupting? Hello. Come on in, Uncle Pedia. Hello, guys. And I just came in for a minute. Well, not so much, but still a little present from my garden, by the way. What's his name? Natural product. They are lying at home. Thank you. You have a seat. Come on. Mm. I think they won't last until May. Well, how are you? Vladka. What are the Esculapians saying? Eh. I will run. And? Well, you won't come to us for a long time now after this. Yes. That's how it happens. It seems like you've been living side by side with people all your life. And then it turns out that you don't know anything about people. Only it still needs to be unraveled. The question is how? Only the two of you are left alive. All right, young people, I've tired you out, I'll go. You need to rest. You need to get drunk. Uncle Singh. And how's mom? The hospital would have her. To a mental hospital, yes. Well, why did you do it so immediately? After all, she also needs to come to herself. Okay, I have to go. Everything will be fine, Lisa. Thank you. And you look, get well. Help yourself. Alpine herbs. Pyotr Andreevich, I can't cope without you. Let's finish the case. See what happens. We have not found the value of the stolen Rudy Chi. With the murder of Kashin and Miralaba, the evidence of Bogdan Boyko's guilt is indirect. Yes. This tourist smartly fits no better than a relative. Your Baba Yaga, this Galena, is also silent, like a partisan. Maybe some sugar and honey? It hurts some kind of affectionate. Will you return the dishes yourself? Yes. Will you have some bread? No. Thank you. Buckwheat with herring. Maybe I'll take it right back. Vlad, everything will be fine. After my mother drove me away from the cemetery on the anniversary of my father's death, and I didn't come to her anymore. You know, your mom, she. She's obviously unwell, and we'll take her to the best doctors. Everything will get better. It's easier for her to believe anyone but me. Well, in order to believe her, she needs to know the truth. Well, does she want to know her? Maybe it's easier that way. And the wife? Yes, Lisa. Mm. All right? Yes, well, that's settled. Where? Come on. Yes, see you later. Help me. Pyotr Andreevich. I, Vasily Alexeevich, am retired. And it's my business to get into it. 
Yes, yes. Not yours. And what am I, in fact, Sitch, Stepan Ruddick and Miroslava are your nephews. The fact that Boyko Jr. killed them is obvious, but unprovable. I'm free, Pyotr Andreevich. Thank you for assisting the investigation. Well, Lisa has arrived. Yes. By the way, why did Miroslava have your jacket with a ticket? And I lent it to her. She wetted it, soiled it. And what is it? My God, do you think he thought it was me? Well, what he thought. Only he could tell us. How's Vladka? I probably said too much in the morning. Maybe you shouldn't have. Yes, everything is fine. However, because of mom worries. It was necessary to worry earlier. After all, he didn't even try to come and talk. Why didn't you try it? I tried, but Maria just didn't want to listen to him. And he, by the way, has been sending money to her every month for all these years. Through this Love Russia. Money? Yeah. Interesting. All right, Lisa, good luck. Well, you come in, I'm right here, next door. Thank you, Peter Andreevich. Absolutely. Goodbye. Happily. <coughs> Maria, are you at home? Good afternoon. Kind. And I'm your son's wife, Vlad. Maria. Maria, listen, it's not his fault. He didn't kill anyone. Maria, us, are you ill? So, come on, come on. You, Peter Andreevich, it's not good for Maria there. We need to call an ambulance. Yes. Hello. We need an ambulance. Here. I am the village of Zilatovo. In the village of Zilatovo. Street. Lugovia 2. Lugovia 2. Yes, a woman feels bad. A woman. What? Hello? Hello? Damn, there's no connection. It's better outside. Hello? Hello? Do you hear? Yes, 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 yes. A woman, age 50, maybe more. Maria, how are you? You need to drink. What? Need to drink. I'm going to get some water. The cure is here. There's medicine on the bedside table. 
medicine? Drink. Kalina laughed. I went to the village. She said she needed to drink. She's treating me. Eric hit. So that he can continue to live on your son's money. Well, nothing. I'm cooking it, I'll definitely check it out. He's on his way soon. Well, how is she? Well, how is she? Judging by the tests, Maria Dmitrievna had been using some kind of psychotropic substance of plant origin for a long time. The dosage was small, but constant. Withdrawal can cause poor health, headaches, nausea, weakness. If there is someone to look after her, then I don't see the need for a hospital. Are you related? Yes. All right, then the repudiation. Thank you, doctor. Have a nice day. Goodbye. Thank you. Goodbye. Who are you, daughter? You said it yourself. My daughter. Now you're confusing me with a girl, and my head is splitting. I don't have any daughters. There were only sons. Your youngest son is alive. Vlad. Well, remember. Vladislav. I'm his wife. I'm sorry, I shouldn't have. Well, my daughter, everything is fine, thank you. Now everything will be different. Well, welcome back. Oh, I think I've been asleep forever. Well, yes, you really missed a lot. But we'll talk about it later. I'm going to cook something. Yes, there must be something in the fridge. I'm potatoes. Oh, I'll figure it out. How are you, Maria? Nothing. The head is only heavy. I don't want to upset you and bore you. You have to write an application for Galena. Here came the results of the examination of that decoction, well, with which she ate you all the time. On acquaintance, it was simple. Quickly done. So, the jackdaw poisoned you. Well, something like a drug. Intentional infliction of harm to health. And you know what, Petru, I'm not going to write anything on it. Well, she purposely drugged you with some rubbish slandered Vlad. I'm no better myself. How did she treat her son? And my sister, she's still for me. You can be discharged home for another couple of days. But you will definitely need to undergo rehabilitation therapy. Yes, Lizaveta Nikolaevna. Good afternoon. Hello. I'm giving you the patient. Thank you. Hi there. Hi there. 
And I've already missed you. And before, he could do without me for weeks. And now I can't even take a minute. So. Hello, mom. Hello, son. I'm still here. I'm sorry, son. I was like out of my mind, like everything was in a fog. I thought I had such a disease. It's not your fault for anything. But now how to return all these years? You have a very good Lisa. I saw her right when I saw her, because I fell in love with my daughter. That's good, son. It's good that you're going to have a baby. That's good. Forgive me, an early Christian, a fool, an old one. Mom, I'm not mad at you. I'm more angry at myself for allowing myself to think like that. What was worth living with bad people? I'm sorry, Max. Vlad will be discharged soon. Come with us. Our house is big, there is a lot of space. My dear, thank you. But where am I going to go? And it will be hard for me in the city, the noisy air is not the same there. And Peter said, the house will soon begin to put a new one. Thank you for giving me the money. They will begin to leave. We need to examine it. Such a case cannot be left unattended. Thank you. But then I almost flew to London. Unless you told me about Dad. And Dad hit it too, didn't say anything. In general, it seems to me that none of this happened in our entire past life. To the mountains. But it all happened. It was. It was. It was. But it passed. We need to disassemble the Christmas tree. And in general, I would change everything here. The walls would have been repainted. And furniture. Did you repaint it too? No. I would also change the furniture. I've never noticed that it's so gloomy here. I agree. It is unlikely to be combined with scattered toys. And who do you want more than a boy or a girl? I want both. And let's, if there's a boy, call him Otvi. It's a beautiful name. And if it's a girl? If it's a girl. I like Masha. And I'm Pelagia. Come on, Pelagia, an old lady's name. Or some kind of crows. Once upon a time there was a crow Pelagia. And the ceiling? Oh, repaint the ceiling too. No, the crow's name is Clara, for example. There would be such a name. The chandelier, too. Oh, the chandelier is monstrous. I'm going to open it. No, I'm going to open it. I need to stretch my leg. Who's there? Vlad Ruich? Yes. 
You are suspected of illegally obtaining, disclosing information constituting a commercial, tax or banking secret, which entailed. Quiet, quiet, carefully, the dropper is standing, what's wrong with me, everything is already fine. Who has it good? Artem Oligovich, can I have you? Yes. The patient regained consciousness. That's fine, prepare for sedatives and analgesics. All right. I'll wake up very well. I am your attending physician, Artem Oligovich. May I? How are you feeling, Elizaveta Nikolaevna? Well, maybe you can tell me what happened? Against the background of physical and nervous exhaustion, you lost consciousness, fell, hit your head, received a slight concussion. Your housekeeper called an ambulance. Allow me. And where is Vlad? Where is my husband? Unfortunately, I don't know where your husband is. Elizaveta Nikolaevna, it is contraindicated for you to get up. You need to rest, calm down. Otherwise, there is a risk of losing the child. The first trimester, the most dangerous. Portia. Write it down for me, I'll give it back, I'll write it down. What are you watching, do you want to play? You can also play. Let's throw a couple of games, do you have any money? There will be. Only you explain the rules to begin with. Eh, Bogdanka, Bogdanushka, the way to the window. And save the bitterness. Here you are, I see, going where? Old stuff. I want to take it down to the barn. I already thought that you forgot about the subscription not to leave and were going on the run. And where to run if there is no guilt? But the examination showed something else. Intentional infliction of harm to health. Here we add the appropriation of other people's funds. Maria is still in doubt whether to write a statement on you or not, but you know, even without her statement, I can try very hard to put you in jail for a long time. Really, neighbor. God sees the truth. Galena. Tell me how it was. It's all of Russia with his envy and greed. That it's not a day's talk that the money will not be for the future for the younger miners. And Bogdanka listened.
I didn't get it. How did you come up with this idea? He said it himself. He himself said that Rudy and the younger ones, the money of the fathers will not be for the future. Come on, drink, and to the bottom. I won't. It's bitter. It stinks. I won't. Let me glue something, step by step. Sin is a great laurel. Give it back. Hide it well. And if anyone finds out, You'll keep your mouth shut, don't get alarmed. The motorcycle was filled up with hay. You tell everyone that Bogdan went to the mountains right after the funeral. So, between the murders Lev Russia kept his son in the winter quarters. And here you are, Maria, intoxicated. Yes, I treated her. She wanted to kill herself. Like a creature, it was easier for your Maria. What did you tell her about Vlad? It's all of Russia. With the patient, he liked to receive sweet money. I'm telling you, greed ruined him. Sign here. What kind of benefactor have you found in your city? What kind of benefactor is there? In the city, I rent out sheepskin to the store. So the increase to the principal drips. The cunning uncle of Russia. Don't let the jackdaw see through you. Oh, and you're rowing. But if a magpie does not shine everywhere, he won't figure it out. My Stepashka. From where? The fire was dismantled. My son. What kind of hatred did it all, you did such a power. Lavrish, they'll find him, won't they? They will punish you, they'll find him, won't they? We have to find it. Have a drink. Have some tea. We have to find it. Is it necessary? The investigators are thinking about Vladka. It's all about money. Is she a tourist? Somehow Bogdanka disappeared. I searched for his laurels in the mountains for several days. I found it in the neighboring area. That's when we heard about the tourist. And why Miroslav? I don't know. Bogdanka didn't freak out for several years then. I asked for everything at the festival. I persuaded the Laurel, said that I was ill and could no longer stand at the fair, his skins to Tula to sell. So he set Bogdanka up. On Bogdan, here's a relative. And I'm Lisa. Come on, I'm uncomfortable. Where to? No, no, no. Take it away. You said it yourself, we're like sisters now. Thank you. And after the fair, he saw her in Lisa's jacket. You tell me something else. And where are the kinsman's goods? Or was it sold long ago? I don't know about that. Clearly. It's hidden in the bathhouse. In the wall behind the stove. Show me. Yes, we will. What about me? What about you? Won't you take it to the police? Let them punish me. Life has already punished you, Galena. To live with such a load. It looks like it's going to be a prison.
How do you feel? That's better. Tell me, did my husband Vlad Kinsman come? Well, it's still time to visit very early. I think he will visit you later. But there is good news. You will be released home soon. And why were you packed up? Yes, I also decided to play. Only the partners had marked cards. Have you been rolling or something? Well, sort of. And where did you roll? Have you sailed trains, hotels, and resorts? Don't take it higher. Where did you go out? Custom-made games with rich buratinoi? Well, almost. Borax. I was playing on the stock exchange. Here you go. Thanks, I don't smoke. Help yourself. Oh, that's good. This is the case. It's me, come here. Will you learn anything from this? You're ours. Was. Well, what are you? Don't. Not you, you fixed it. Wait, I'll be right there. We are the victims. Vasily Alexeevich, I have this question for you. Me. And what are outsiders doing here? There are investigative actions here, by the way. Step back behind the fence. Oh, you little bastard. Didn't you hear me? Over the fence. Don't, Peter. It's not worth it to waste your nerves on it. That's it. Absolutely everything is against your husband. There is a motive, there is evidence, there is evidence. And how much can they give him? Up to five years if the damage is large, and he's big. Is there really nothing you can think of? I don't even know. Unless the plaintiff withdraws the claim or enters into a settlement agreement, but, according to my information, that side is very determined. I'm afraid it won't be possible to negotiate with them. if you can't. Uncle Roma, surely you have options for solving this annoying problem. Beautiful. Options, you say? There is an option. More precisely, one option. Well, you probably won't like it. I'm listening. You're giving me your whole share. I'm withdrawing the claim. I'm going to make peace. Hey. Where did you learn to play like that, huh? There is such a science, mathematics is called. I see. Ruddick, out.
face the wall. Come on in. I bailed you out. A big deposit. Yes, you'll be home here, but whether you will be there after the trial depends. Yes, it depends on a lot of things. I'll explain everything. Yes, explain to me how it was possible to leak our insider to competitors. Can I tell you? Resentment, you know, is not a better advisor. After what happened in the forest, everything else seems to me to be some kind of mouse fuss that has nothing to do with the present. But I didn't know that then. He sat there, grinding his teeth. I kept thinking about what to come up with, and then suddenly this Alexander called, the CEO of the investment technology of our competitors, offered to meet, then. Wait. So it wasn't your idea. Alexander called. We have agreed on a two-way option. And under this case, I registered a company in Cyprus. Was it Alexander who suggested you? It seems so. Or maybe I am. Oh, what a fool you are. Vladislav Mihailovich, didn't you know that Cyprus merges beneficiaries at the request of our tax service? Oh. It was like I was in a fever. I fucked up, in a word. Well, according to your Cyprus offshore company, they figured you out. I see. Yes, he did something. Well, nothing. If we survived in the mountains, then here. It's amazing. How I didn't notice it before. So, let's do it again in order. Alexander called you after Uncle Roma deprived you of this award, right? So. And then he made a complete idiot of himself in front of everyone, and very angry. Yeah. And emotions are a bad advisor. And that's what they played on. And they are. Uncle Roma and Alexander. It would be fine if I offered at least a symbolic price for the shares. So no, he wants it for nothing. And you tell your Uncle Roma that you have shares as collateral and that you will only hand over the right ransom. The exchange rate of the securities is low now. Do you get my point? I catch it. And me. That's right. And you? Come on in, Oleg Vladimirovich is waiting for you. Of course, he's waiting. Well, hello, Elizaveta Nikolaevna, please. Thank you. I am pleasantly surprised by your visit. What do you prefer at this time of day? Tea, coffee, maybe water, juice or something stronger? I, Oleg Vladimirovich, prefer profitable deals at any time of the day. 
I recognize the breed of Nicholas. A true daughter of her father. Even, you know, it's kind of a pity that I had to go to your competitors. Hopefully not for long. Well, I'm ready. What will you lure and charm with? Roman Evgenievich, I thought about it and decided that, in fact, your proposal is the only way out for us. For me. Only I didn't tell you right away. My shares are pledged. And that's what I thought. For the withdrawal of claims and the conclusion of a settlement agreement with a complete waiver of claims, I am ready to transfer to you the right to repurchase shares from the collateral. They are now mortgaged at the exchange rate price, and stock prices are low because of all the turmoil that has occurred in the company. This is where I lost. Well, no, Lazanka. No, your shares don't cover the damage anyway, and even more so that you will have to pay some money for the ransom. No, I'm not ready to incur additional expenses. I understand. But I don't have anything else. Just a house. Some remaining money in the accounts and a few cars. Unless only to sell them. I'm sorry. But I was going to help you, but I guess I'll have to sell everything. Investors will not understand if they are not compensated for the damage. There is also a gallery. You can keep the gallery. But you have to live on something. You know. I'm still not used to this house. A house is not a wall. These are people. It was dad's house, and dad's gone. But this is your home, too. He built it for you. I don't know. It always seemed strange to me that there were only two people living in such a big house. You know, I often think of our old apartment. Yes, I was still a little girl then. And my mom was alive. And there was so much warmth. So much comfort in that little soul. It will never be like this here. She saved us all. And you and me. And our baby. Well, now they are together with dad. With their child. Forever.
Hello. I'm sorry, I don't understand you. I know, understand. Do you understand? Don't call, please, I don't understand you. Who is this, Sima? Mom, are you up again? And then we'll call an ambulance. Yes, I'm leaving. Well, who called? So. And who? So. These debtors again. We are the debtors, Mom. And these are creditors. I didn't take anything from anyone. I didn't take anything from anyone either, Mom. I'm sorry, Lisa. I tore you apart. No, not at all, not at all. What kind of business? I'm just... I can't accept that there's no guts. Have you been there? You'll find out. I've already gone to rescue you. Yes. And he saved. If it wasn't for Nikita, I wouldn't be sitting here right now. He was a good friend and a real man. You have raised a wonderful son. Thank you, Lisa. He loved you very much. I know. I'm his, too. Lisa, I have. I have a request for you. Or rather, not a request, but a question. I want to sell our apartment. Urgently sell. Do you understand? Yes. And what am I? Well, I thought maybe you know someone. Or maybe you could buy one. You have a wealthy family, and I need it urgently. What happened? Nikita, when he was abroad, he took money from some people. They called him. And I think that's why he suddenly came back like that. I was looking for a job. I was very nervous. I tried to take a loan. I was looking for all the money. Well, and now, when, Nikita, are they calling us now? They threaten and, to be honest, I do not know what to do. I see. Well, we have to go to the police and write a statement. Well, how? He took money from these people. Yes, but you didn't take it. You didn't even vouch for them. Well, yes. The police. Well, I don't know. Although, no, don't go to the police. Do you remember Proker Klenov? Our classmate. Proker, Proker. Yes, I remember. Well, I remember. Proker has popes in the organs and Proker himself serves there. Listen, well, we were all worried then, of course. We were already going to rush to your rescue as soon as possible, but they have already found you. Yes, I can't believe there isn't. Yes, well, if it hadn't been for him, things might have ended differently. Prosh, I want to ask you. Can you help Nick's mom and grandma? Yes, of course, because Skya. No, 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 that's not what I'm talking about. I'll hide it. There's such a story there. In short, Nikiti, when he was abroad, he took money from bandits. Well, as I understand it, quite a large sum. And, as expected, he did not return it. Then he came back. They found him here. They called a hundred times. There are still some percentages running up. In short, now they are bullying Nikita's mother. And she was already going to sell the apartment, and she offered it to me. And I wanted to know, could you sort this out? Liz, let's figure it out. This is not a question at all.
What? Blackie, are you washing up the guests for us? Yeah. Maria. There's someone here to see you. Who's there? And here. I'm going away for a while. Go. Don't eat it. Hello, Marie. Hello, Galina. I came to thank you to say that you didn't write a statement against me. She didn't let them put me in a cage. Yeah, whatever. Sisters, we are with you after all. Sisters. I understand. You must be mad at me. So sorry. They tell you here, I know that I've been paying you. And you don't believe it. I treated you for a mental illness. Doctors put me on my feet for this disease in a week. And you've been burning my soul and poison for so many years. Who to believe? You shouldn't have done that. I had no grudge against you, no intention. Well, what now? Everything was overgrown. What's already here? I want to leave forever. It's hard for me here. No one is talking. When they meet, they run away. They call her a witch. But I have helped so many of them. Nothing. Give me time, maybe they'll forget. Will you forgive me? Please forgive me. God has already punished me. No husband, no son. The son was buried like an animal behind the fence of the cemetery. God punishes, God forgives. I don't hold a grudge. She herself is sinful. She made a mistake about her son. That's it, Galena. Good road to you. Well, that's how Betty and I are. Goodbye, Maria. Thank you for everything. Darling? No, not expensive, but beautiful. No, wait, I'm keeping this one for myself. Hi there. Roman Evgenievich, this is for you from Jur. Departments. Do we have champagne? There is. Come on. All right. She signed everything. 
Tomorrow we are buying up its shares for pennies. We immediately announced the merger of the companies. Reactive capitalization growth, stocks are rising in price. I love these combinations. They got off quickly. Yeah, I thought we'd be there all day. Yeah. And I congratulate you. We are free. But at what price? Well, it's time. It's time. Hello, Oleg Vladimirovich. Now you can. Yes, yes, everything is as we agreed. Yeah. I would like to see the second part of this Marlison Ballet now. Me too. Roman Evgenievich, the financial director, is here to see you. Let him do it. Roman Evgenievich. Are you already aware? Aware of what? Well, in general, several large clients have announced their return to our company, including Oleg Vladimirovich Slutsky. I remember you were particularly worried about his departure, but it seems that he is with us again. Our shares are growing, the market has already reacted and I wanted to. Wait, wait. Your champagne. Get out of here. Stocks are rising in price. What's going on? Shall we buy her shares for a penny? Well. I personally do not have such pennies. And you? Here you go. Thank you. Don't you feel sorry for the company? My father gave his whole life to build it. You know, Dad's company has always been doing things that can't be seen. Or touch it. Cold numbers. You know I've never liked numbers. Dad, Roman, you're always alone surrounded by numbers. What are we going to do now? I don't know. Demand. From whom? Near the mountains. Crystal Peaks. It's a fairy tale. In theory, you should be disgusted with the mountains right now. No, this is a very bad idea. After all, our family is there, so that's where our house is. How amazing you are. It's our turn. Let's go. My dear children, we eat good. Oh, oh. Well, are you at least for a long time, daughter? Hello. For a long time, mom. Maybe forever. Oh, come on. Let's go inside. Be careful. Oh, how are you here? Be careful. Come on. Come on in. Come on in, bunny.
Wait for the hot one, right, daughter? No. Mom, sit down. That's it. That's it. That's it. I'm sitting down. Have you seen the construction site? Not yet. Oh, they'll be putting up walls there soon. The beautiful house is large. We'll all fit. You'll definitely go, right? Come on, maybe I'll put something else in. No, mom, thanks, that's it, on. That's it, exactly, thank you. Everything was very tasty. You're welcome. We're going for a walk in the meantime. For now. I'll see you off. Just look carefully there. Yes, absolutely. Gallery, which lies Nikolaevna Kinsman. The brightest events related to contemporary art take place here. Several paintings of the Crystal Mountains Gallery were sold at a recent auction. The cost of one of them reached $300,000. I have great hope that this event will move the market of our country from the dead point. You know, it was still a great idea to issue a pledge on my shares. It's good that Oleg Vladimirovich agreed to play this game. Yes, he's a gambler. Yeah, you should have seen his eyes when you laid out our plan to him. A risky plan. Oh, yeah. And on the other hand, well, imagine, some girl comes to you and says, Uncle, take my shares of a top invest type as collateral. And when I ask, come back as a client to the same top invest and take your friends with you. And when the stock goes up, sell. Well, how would you react? Well, if such a girl came to me, it would be positive. I'm serious. How much did he take? 30%. But we still have more left than before your participation in their scam. How's our baby? All right. I did an ultrasound before leaving. Why didn't you tell me? Who's there, boy? I won't say. Well, don't tell me. So, what should I do? Pat your hands, stomp your feet. For what? To see the crystal peaks. Our future. You just have to watch. I'm looking. But I see. Where? And here it is right in front of you. Um. I don't see it. Just mountains. Just mountains. We will build a ski resort there. Good idea. Dad loved mountains. I think his grandchildren will like it too. Grandchildren? How do you like Stepan and Motvi?